Is it not going to work again today? Literally before stream, I checked that this would work. And it did. And now it's not. And it's driving me nuts. Screw you, OBS. I don't know what changed with my driver updates, but blew something up. Anyways, hello everyone. Base of here. Welcome back to some more boyfriend dungeon. I believe we're going to be finishing it today. Um, no idea why OBS refuses to move stuff like it's supposed to, but... And it is what it is. What's going on, Citric? Welcome to the stream. I haven't seen you in a minute. Um... Oh, I wasn't focused in the game. That's why I wasn't moving. All right. Let's find out what the heck is going on with this game. Uh, I don't remember where exactly I left off. But I think I can just go to the map. Where's our next uh, dungeon? Because LaRosa's done. Mm, I'm confused. Is there no more dungeon? Oh, I have, a, I have a date at the mansion, apparently. And it's an unknown date. You arrive just as the hearse drives away. The hearse? I see someone died. Hello. A young person stares down the street after it. Bye. The bird said something to me. I like your hair. Until next time, Alice. Farewell. Uh. Okay. Who's Alice? Next time, I'm sorry for your loss. Who invited me here? This, this isn't Pocket, is it? Don't talk about her. You didn't know her. Okay, rude. Oh, it's you. Hey, what? Huh. Why did you come here? Uh... You know me? Never mind that right now. Answer me. Why did you come here? I'm just exploring the town, dude. Chill. They pursed her lips, eyes dark. No, I meant Verona Beach. You're the cause of all this, you know. Hey, what? Don't blame the me. Monsters, the universe thrown out of balance. Are you okay? If it weren't for you, maybe Alice would still be alive. Are, what? What are you? What are you smoking, bro? Your shape begins to change. Great. Your sleep schedule got all summered up, messed up. Yeah. I uh, I can relate to that. I don't have a sleep schedule anymore. <laughs> Although that might have to change soon. Oh, your eyes went purple and pink. Are you going to attack me? Wait, what? <gasps> You're a size? You're both a Maybe single weapon? End you and see if status quo returns. How do you attack me as just a scythe? Scythe. They seem serious. It seems like an important decision. Your life is on the line. Uh... Just do it then. Motherfucker. What's wrong with you? I'm gonna say just do it then. Enticing temptation. Almost sexual. Okay. I don't think this person's okay. The science gleams hungrily at your urging as if wedded. There's a moment of silence as a breed passes between you. <sighs> Fine. I can't just kill a random person I just met. I guess. Even you. The fuck? Pretty human. Hey, bird. Thank you. Hush. I like your bird. Uncertainty passes over their features. So, why... Why did you come to Verona Beach? I don't have to tell you anything. You should apologize, dude. Who even are you? I'm Rowan. My threat wasn't personal, I assure you. Are you serious? I have so many questions for you, Rowan. Also, you got the hair covering over the eye thing, and uh, I gotta tell you, you're confusing me. But I suppose I would also feel angry in your situation. Though I hadn't expected you to respond the way you did. I must remember that you are unpredictable. Perhaps more dangerous than I thought. What? Oh, well. 
The reason you came to Verona Beach doesn't particularly matter. My grandmother is gone either way. Oh, it's your grandma. And you're here now. We'll have to survive somehow, in spite of your chaos. I didn't do shit. What chaos? You know, dungeons everywhere, creatures running amok. Someone's violating the laws of nature. I There's just live here, bro. Rippling. You've been seeing weapons damaged, haven't you? It's a pattern of evil intent. Only and it's my fault, how? My caliber can hope to make things right again. And I should get back to it. That's what Alice would have wanted. Alice is his grandma. Are you a witch? They don't acknowledge your question and turn away. Hi, bird. They disappear. What's your bird's name? They disappear into the house, leaving you alone on the street. What the fuck just happened? Oh, I'm so confused. Okay. Maybe I should explore the map a little more. I wish you could zoom out. Okay, you can't go that way. Can't go through those. There's an airplane. Oh, there's a cute little farm down here. What the fuck just happened? Am I just supposed to keep doing more dungeons? Is that what's... I don't know what I'm actually supposed to be doing anymore. Did I accidentally beat the game too soon? I'm kind of confused. Um... Oh, I can't play with that guy yet. All right, let's play with Pocket. If I start at 12, does it just... Oh, that's new. Do I just get a ton more experience? Get him, kitty. This game is kind of weird. Did you play this game, Citric? Well, see, I already did this. Right, you gotta beat these things up. Stay away, poison blob. Oh. The game is loud all of a sudden. Oh, they're making goops all over the ground. Music is so good in this game. Maybe I gotta beat it up with each of my weapons. Heck you, mouth. Everyone go to sleep. Oh, that spawn. Uncool. Did I heal? Ah! A lot of things right there. Stay away from me. Easy clap. No, you're just confused? I'm equally confused. I did it. Oh, I forgot. That's what I forgot to do. Last time I was here, I forgot to go in the basement. Cowboy hat. Single malt scotch. All right, here we go. I think there. I think now we are unlocking a new dungeon. What the fuck? You find a scrap of paper has been slipped into your window from outside. The paper is thick and strong as if torn from an old book. It has a series of numbers and markings on it somewhere upside down. GPS coordinates... IP address. No, it's not an IP address. Rotation cipher? Dewey decimal number? You try matching the most common numbers to common letters and working backwards. You work at it for a while, but either there's not enough vowels 
or too many Z's and Y's. You study it for a while, but aren't sure how to use this information helpfully. You set the puzzle aside for now, itching for more physical challenge. It looks like another beautiful California day outside. Okay. Why is one of the dateable? It's not, I don't, I'm not dating the cat. I think you end up dating the, uh, the owner or something. Because I, I talked to the owner. Jesse said not to worry, now I'm worried. You've gotten so strong and independent this summer, but I'm still your mom and I'm still here for you, so is something wrong? No? I want to say n no, because there's nothing wrong. I'll handle it. That was a mean thing to say. I'm sorry, mom. Okay, but just I want to say everything's related. You probably know who's hurting you. Bring the fight to their doorstep. But if you decide to just hide in your apartment until it's time to come home, that's okay too. Thanks, Mom. You're coming home soon. I should probably hide it, but I can't wait. I love her. <laughs> What's that mean? Wait, you better not be thinking of staying there forever. I mean, I support you becoming fearless and independent, but you gotta come home first, okay? I miss you too much. <laughs> I know, Mom. Okay, I'm trusting you. Come come home now and then, then. Come home now and then, baby bird, please. You got it, Mom. Fuck you, Eric. I'm out of the hospital. But... I don't need to give him his voice. I'm reading his text messages. Uh, I don't remember what this conversation was. I'm out of the hospital, by the way. Not that you care. My near-death experience made me realize I have to come clean. What did you do? It's hard to know where to start. I stole parts of weapons of people to make Masamune. You're fucking... Yep. It's you, you piece of shit. A chip from a dagger, a pin from a lightsaber, and so on. I had fallen in love with each one, but they turned me away. All of them. You fell... <sighs> this guy just thinks falling... Seeing someone that he thinks is attractive is that him falling in love. So I took a part of them. You're fucking creepy, dude. I thought I'd reshape into something new, something beautiful, but I knew my heart better than I did. But it knew my heart better than I did, and so it became a monster, just like you. And you became a stalker. You're the monster. I want to say both of these. And you became a stalker. Don't frowny face me. Yeah, I was obsessed with your very small, with your every small kindness. I'm sorry. I really am. You don't know what it's like. Being unloved. You don't know that, motherfucker. Okay. That's not my fault. Yeah, that's not my fault. Wait. Was I saying that's not my fault that he's acting that way? Or it's not my fault that I've never been unloved? Because it, it's... I would have said something different. Stop talking. I'm trying to read. Oh my god. Stop it. Sorry, sorry again. I, I shouldn't make up make excuses. I don't deserve your pity. I'll figure out how to put things right somehow. To put things right, I need help. I can't deal with Masamune on my own. Please, you might be the only one strong enough, and he's already fixated on you. You don't have to forgive me, but until he's dealt with, he's dangerous. I've already sent Jesse instructions. All right, I can deal with that. Okay, so I know you're leaving town soon, but I think I know fuck, know how to defeat Eric's monster. Can you stop texting while I'm reading? That's annoying. <sighs> so annoying. Which, by the way, now that I've looked it up, Eric naming this monster Masamune is Ridic. Somewhere out there, there's a gorgeous Japanese man I'd call Masamune. But this weirdo, I'm just going to call him Katana. Anyway, here's the plan. You beat him up. Genius. <laughs> Thanks. Wait till you hear the brilliant part. We're going to lure Katana into Eric's forge where he was made. And then I'm going to do some blacksmithing magic. Weaken him. Weaken him. Then you can spring out and fight him. What is this? Mordor? You know magic? With my bare hands? <laughs> you know magic? With my bare hands? No, no. Bring a weapon. Obviously your fave, I guess. Shit. When you're ready, call me from the weapon shop. Keep your weapon friend sheathed as a surprise. 
Uh, you know how weird air gets when weapon folks are around. It'll probably be a pretty tough fight, though. Make sure you're ready. Really ready. Super ready. Like, trained 12 years for this moment ready. Are we in a hurry? What if he attacks? Uh, run away? I think you're safe during the day, though. Okay. Okay. Feels like years since I dropped you off at the airport. The house has been so quiet without you. What do you want to eat when you get home? Uh, whatever is fine. Okay, dog food tartar. Tar tar. It is. JK, we can figure it out when you get here, love. See you soon. Goodbye, Mom. Okay. Is there another fight open? Doesn't look like it. Well, what about fucking Ramona or whatever the person's name was? Can I not date anyone else? Okay. We'll start from floor one. <laughs> Oh, wait, bug. Laser beam. Oh, it's a stab. Love it. I think you're doing. Oh, laser beams. Get out of here. Oh, I got hit by something. Oh. I got a suit. I didn't need to grab that. It's fine. Ooh, a lounge? I didn't need those. It's fine. Not a lounge. What is this? Money! I have five hundred dollars. So all the waifus and husbandos turned into weapons. Yes. Then we go on dates and stuff. Step, step, step. Dark eyeliner. Ooh. All right, we got it. Trash can we ah he stabbed me. I kinda wanna look for the the little break rooms too. To see if we can uh increase some of our relationships. Maybe I, that's what I should do. Maybe I should just die of a single person for now. So I guarantee I unlock all the stuff. Or something. I don't know. Laser beam! Laser- oh! I didn't see the second one. Ouch. It's fine. So much stronger, I'm playing like garbage. Okay, daisies. Cute. I need to find something to spend this money on. Oh, here you go! Flopping in the seat feels good. You realize you're more tired than you thought. Fighting takes a lot out of you, doesn't it? Maybe we've been pushing ourselves too hard lately. Larry stifles a yawn. But it's not too late to learn from our mistakes. It's safe. How about a quick cat nap? Oh yeah. I think we've read this one. But Larry's lips quirk up into a fond smile. I'll say in the shit. Yeah, we, we've done this one before. Damn it. Alright. Um. There was a little... Oh, I didn't open it. Son of a... You know what? We're going to open this. And then we're going to see if we can actually buy something from the shop since I'm sitting at 500. Or we go to the... Um... 
what is it the, the theater or whatever it was maybe uh we can spend some money there because stuff was real expensive if i remember right i don't know a lot of questions let's see if we can get our get ourselves some answers hello glue there I don't know what I need those for yet there I spent a bunch of money oof yeah I just spent a hundred dollars it's fine later We gotta find some place so I can give her a gift. Ooh, take that. Get out of here. Get out of here. Martinis. Stabs. Something hit me. Look at all the boba teas. Rude, dude. Get out of here. Ouch. It's fine, I know what I'm doing. Laser. Oof. That's why I like the dagger. The attack is a dash as well. Sword cufflinks. That's going to be for uh, Isaac, I think. Kind of sounds like it would be. He likes cufflinks and stuff. Dressing up all dapper and the like. Ooh! Rest time. Huh? Oh, yeah. We've done this one before. Sure, why not? Mm -hmm. Maybe I can give her a... Uh... Um... Of course. <laughs> <laughs> she winks and also raised from bar, leaving her empty glass. That one I didn't do before, last time. Okay. Okay. Hey, she's maxed. Um, I guess we'll go do pocket. We should do the... I shouldn't do my good weapons first. God damn it! See? Now I get these ones. I don't have freaking Valeria anymore. Hey, what do you want? Do you want... There's no way you'd want a camera, right? He wants a camera! Oh, it's a pose. Ah, he yawns and stretches luxuriously, the envy of yoga teachers everywhere. Mid yawn, pocket paws a strange alert, fur fluffing. What is it? You look around and realize you sent something too. Someone is here. Hello. Strange man steps out from the shadows, eyeing you both. You're the guy I bought shit from. <laughs> alright, alright, you found me. Don't attack. I'm Vitus Varnus. Yeah, I I just bought stuff from you. I was just taking a break from the shop. But here, I'll give you a special deal. Two fabric for ten bucks. Basically, half the price. Okay. And we're done here. Stay safe. This is Varnus strolls back to the dungeon. Pocket hits his farewell. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, I don't one-shot them anymore. Ooh, got some glue. No, I need the money. Ow! I love hearts. Yeah, get wrecked. Get out of here. Sneaker it for me. A bowler hat. Oh, that's a lot of lasers. I thought that 
Vistus Virtus, whatever his name is, was going to be a uh, pocket owner. Ow, the hand grabbed me. Ow, laser beams got me. Queen perfume. We know that's for seven. All right, cat's maxed. Let's do uh, Sawyer. Oh, oh, I forgot how to play with Sawyer. Pocket is missing. Wait, what? What happened to Pocket? Ooh, ooh, ooh. What happened to Pocket? Pocket is missing. I found a pair of brass knuckles in my kitchen. Is this a threat? Did you take my cat hostage? The knuckles are your cat. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Wait, something's happening. Well, Pocket's back anyway. Sorry for the accusation. Did... Did you not know your cat is a weapon? I guess he was sleeping some more here. Now he wants to go out. I'll watch him. So there, he's out. And look, and looks like he's headed for the museum. Have fun. Okay. I think your cat likes me more than you. I forget what my, um, oh, can we rest here? Oh, I, I might have missed it. I forgot what my abilities are with Sawyer. Oh, here. Excuse me. Oh, fancy. I've never been a very important person past the velvet rope. Oh, wait. There are monsters. Uh -huh. Yeah, but the monsters didn't exactly let us in or check a list of names. Oh, well. They settle in the cushion, relaxing as best they can. So now what? What are you doing in the VIP section? Just sit here? Being very important? Yeah, the rest of this week is the same. Okay. Oh! I thought I was at the end. Ow. Oh, that's right. When that comes back, it explodes. Ha! It juggled. Keep your hearts to yourself. I can't. There it goes. I would like that money, please. Oh, wasn't ready for you. Oh, that exploded quite largely. Cultist robes. I thought I did a bigger slash. There it is. Boom. Top hat and a monocle. <laughs> I have to make that. All right, Sawyer. We're going to stick with it. It's not broken. Okay. We got something here. So your eyes widen. You jacked up? Yeah. Um, oh, I don't have any food. You want a game? Yes! Oh, neat. I don't know if I can 100% it, but I'll try. This reminds me of the of Valentine bear I gave my friend in fourth grade. Oh, shit. Maybe I should have gave them the bear. It was really cute little white teddy bear holding a red heart. I thought it was just a nice toy she'd like, but the other kids thought it meant I had a crush. They teased me in her endlessly, and I found the bear in the trash. 
We didn't talk much after that. Oh, that's sad. They fell silent looking at their balloons. At the heart balloons. So, uh, what is this place? Just a nice place to be, or are you... Do you... I mean... Let's make out. I like you. <laughs> Just a nice yeah. place. Oh, well, good. I'm glad that's clear then. No misunderstandings. Thanks for bringing me. It's nice to be with you here. Careful when you swing me. I won't, wouldn't want to pop a balloon. Sawyer's precious. <gasps> Shit, I wasn't... That took a lot of life. Very rude. Oh. What? Oh, I was going to be mad if you could attack through a wall and I can't. Oh. I need life. Give your hands to yourself. What? I was trying to do my super slam move and it didn't work. Machine sign? Ooh! Got a new power. Alright, next weapon. Alright, uh. Seven's closest. I don't remember how to play with seven. Fuck. Fuck. There's too many of you. They messed me up. Damn, back up to 600 monies. Ooh, steel. I'll take it. Ooh, darkness. Got a rest joint. Uh. Yeah, you already, we already did this with you. Uh, fun? <laughs> yeah, fun. I guess it, that's the thing people have sometimes. We have way better things to do together anyway. Like beat downs. You said the same thing. My nose. It's just so bad down here. Constantly feels like there's a, a hair stuck on the end of my nose. That's a lot of laser beams. sword. I'll take that cloth. Ooh. Got a dark and a holy energy. Do certain weapons drop certain or cause more certain items to drop more often? this please and thank you <gasps> another zine bug princess zine yo Am i gonna create bugs futurist cape get out of here so close next Keep your hearts away from me. No, oh, it's just gonna be a loop. Look at all these bubble glasses.
See how I do under pressure? What are you talking about? Oh, bubbles. Or hearts. I want these. Thank you. No one's allowed. I don't need a break, but we can still take one. Okay. Hey! Will you actually perform? What a, what a cute little venue. The acoustics and lighting are great, but it does the job. With this small area, you're, higher chance of heck you're at a higher chance of heckling. That's worse. Have you been heckled? Mm -hmm. Oh, sure. Especially at the beginning. Once we were accidentally booked into a heavy metal club. Oh, boy. It was uh. not good. That kind of experience toughens you, though, even when hecklers were at their worst. I soon learned I loved dancing and that I was good at it. It was reassuring in a way. Purpose and direction isn't the same as happiness, but it's something to hold on to, like a hilt. Oh. I don't have the cologne. Do you want a cactus? He wants a cactus! Thanks, it's so weird to have a gift hand delivered these days. Come on, let's find some hecklers to take down a notch. Hell yeah, dude. I'm glad you like the little cactus. Ouch. Lots of damagis coming at me. Wanderer recipe. What is this? Crap. I forgot the name of it. Lost Titan. Not Lost Titan. Crap, my nephew was just playing it. The one with the giants. That's all you fight. It's a fantastic game. I, why can't I think of it? My brain's thinking Lost Titan, Lost Ember. It's neither of those. Shadow of the Colossus. That's it. Oh my god, this takes forever to do any damage. Stay away from me. Hey, look, another one of these. Now, here's an edifice of value at last with this er within this erotic mm -hmm. wasteland. I do enjoy a good performance. What's your favorite sort? Opera? Lectures? Concerts? Stand-up comedy? Dance? Concerts! Bye. Oh, same for me. There's something so universal about live music. Even though I don't really understand the newer genres, I understand their appeal. It's all about the emotion, the connectedness, the humanity, right? Though not just humans perform. I read that ravens have what appear to be storytelling circles. Hmm. Maybe we should invite some ravens on the scene to see what they have to say sometime. That sounds awesome. Or maybe we should get back to the task at hand. Do you want... I don't think you'll want any of those. Oh, Seven's texting me about some cool show. Ah, crap. I'm gonna die. I got a photo. Designer pods? What? Like, AirPods? Alright, you, um. You finish your text message, and then I'll read it after you're done. Oh, lame. I didn't see that until the last second. Ouch. Oh my god. They were coming at me. Alright, he's done texting. What do we got? Uh, It's been cool going to the dungeon, but it's not exactly cozy. I saw a poster for this cool show. Chronosite. That does look kind of cool. Oops. No, I was reading that. 
I'd invite you over to watch TV, but my agent has this place bug for sure. That's creepy. Yeah, but contracts. There's a contract that you can be spied on? That's so not okay. Can we hang out at your place? Or would that would it be weird? If you don't answer, that's okay, I get it. Sure. Cool, I'll be there soon. I'm in a dungeon, bro. Oh my god, look at all the enemies. Nose, dude. Oh, the chest. The chest is hiding there. Can I have this? Thank you. Love letter. Ooh, I can write someone a love letter. Fine leather gloves. That sounds like uh, something Seven would want. Things are getting really hard with these. Oh God, these weapons I'm not good with. Ouch. Fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna get my butt kicked here soon. Royal crown. Can I give someone a crown? Oh snap, the stompy boy. Woo. Oh, he died real quick. Normally, he takes a minute. Ouch. Ow! Floaty things everywhere. Rest time? Hmm. Fascinating. People's decisions never cease to surprise me. Someone spent time and energy to do this. Make a love nest. Here. Of all places. Uh... I don't mean to assume, but... Hmm. You brought me here. You brought me here. You must have your reasons, perhaps <gasps> romantic reasons. I thought it was funny. <laughs> ah, it is, I suppose. And the way anything strange and incomprehensible is the music. Would you like to offer? I don't have any gifts for you. Sorry. Thank you for bringing me here. All the same, I'm ready to get back to the battle. Oh, lasers. Shit. Ow, fuck. I hit like a freaking freight train. Stop eating me up. Getting my butt kicks now. All right, any other hidden things? No. There is barrel down there that I can pop. Hopefully give me a health. Nope. I think they drop health a lot at the beginning. And then like none. Ah! That was lame. Ooh. I got some glue. Valkyrie band. Ooh. Angel costume. Man, there's a lot of freaking outfits and stuff in this game. Maybe it's because the gameplay loop in the actual game is pretty short. So they want you to keep playing to get more stuff. Which I'm like, oh yeah, I'll do it for the achievements. I'm not playing on Steam, so I don't get the achievements. Oh god. Alright, you gotta actually pay attention. Stop it. Damn it. I can't grab that. No, no, no. I can. There you go. There's something over there. Ooh, I can't believe you missed. That one hit me, though. Ow. Twice. Oh, is it just the... It was just the weird table. Fuck.
Ow, that hit me. That's where I dodged it. Ah! Ow, ow, ow. Push the wrong button. Too many things. Ouch. Ouch. I need heals. Woo. Need heals, bro. Oh, that almost hit me. Shit. Laser beam is going to be a problem. There we go. Oh. A baby heal. That fucking missed him, bro. I couldn't dodge that. Oh. Die, 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 die. Don't aggro that thing yet. Okay, we're fine. Oh. Oh, yeah, I have... Crap, I should be using that. Oh. Lots of stuff. I need to be using that little... <gasps> and then you roll afterwards. I didn't know that. Makes a little bit more sense. Ooh, will that be a rest point? Isaac takes a deep breath and releases it, looking pleased. I don't have a gift. <sighs> Finally, somewhere I can breathe. And is that pine I smell on the breeze? Did you know just looking at trees reduces stress and lowers blood pressure? I believe it. I tried putting on posters of trees in my office, but they didn't seem to have the same effect. Mm. Nothing like the real thing, I suppose, in nature or in combat. No matter how much I enjoy dueling, the dungeon is where the real growth happens. Now it's time for the looking at... Now is not the time for looking at trees. Now is the time for action. Got it. Oh, sweet. I gotta heal. Please tell me you're going to be leveled up after this, because we might have to leave. Nice. All right. I think we might be able to pull this off asunder. Oh, it's the boss. Okay. This might actually be difficult with Sunder. God damn it. Yep. It's hard with Sunder. Music is dope. the things that are spawning while breaking down this fortress. Hey! 
here we go. Last phase! Easy! Whew. Hooray! We did it! Fucking diamond, bruh. We might level up a few times. I did the entire dungeon. Oh, I'm a hero. You have a few minutes before Sven... Or Sven. Seven will be here. You're struck by sudden anxiety. Your apartment feels suffocating, dry, and boring. I'll tidy up. You do a bit of tidying and dusting, even though it's already practically clean. You imagine his face of disgust or disappointment, and your heart hammers in your chest. Everything goes dark. You feel a hand on your shoulder in here. Hey. Hey, it's okay. Breathe. I knew I should have breathed. Slowly, you take a shaky breath and open your eyes. Hey. Hey, I'm here. I have a glass of water for you. How did you... Sorry, I barged in. The door was unlocked, and I felt like something was wrong. I had to check. <laughs> I'm glad I did. It seemed like you needed someone. You always seem so together, but I know how it is. Not anxiety exactly, but I'm uh, chronically depressed. At first I thought it was the stress of Blade Generation. I'm sure Blade, Gen Blade Generation doesn't make it easier, but depression is part of who I am. I'm mostly on top of it. Therapy, meds, routines, they help me manage. Uh... But if I seem cold sometimes, that's why. Old coping habits mostly. Thanks for telling me. It's harder now that Sun Wu is getting even closer to my territory, but hmm. I was really glad you invited me over today. I've been suing. I got some designer glasses. Here, have these. A fashion designer sent me these for a sponsorship, but they'd look better on you. Thanks. Sure, no problem. As for tonight, there's a new season of, of series I'd like to binge. Chronosite. It won a bunch of awards. It's a detective story. Or it's a detective mystery show set in the future. And I brought cheesies as a snack, too. I love snacks! Uh, oh, I found your weak spot, huh? Mine, too. But you can have... But you can have most of them. My agent will kill me if I overdo it anyway. Man, you got, like, no freedom. He falls into your account and you put on Chronosite. It seems to mostly take place in alleys with smoking vents at night. They keep hinting that the detective can transform into a weapon. But not what kind. I'm a detective. Whichever way I step, fate is waiting to trip me up. Smoking jazz singer. Then maybe you should try should trip her first. Seven munches on cheesy. He glances at you sidelong. Lean back. Looks like there's more this than six bullet holes. Somehow she had time to reload. That's impossible. Unless <laughs> Seven leans in you slightly, his knees brushing yours. The detective assistant is short lived and dies under mysterious circumstances. Wait. Play that recording again. The voice in the call is Smokey. And Jazzy. Smokey Jazzy. You'll never take me alive, Cybercop. I'm the Garoot. No, I'm the Garoot. There's only one room for... Oh, there's only room for one in this town. Seven lips quirk upwards, enjoying the show. Huzzah! Chain Lightning does more damage when it doesn't fork. Chain Lightning prefers to target enemies with lowest health. Uh, sure. You are acutely aware of Seven's breathing next to you. I will say platonic. You enjoy the rest of the show together until the credits roll. Would you like to offer a gift? Do I have... I don't have anything. You decided not to give a gift right now. I really like you, but I, I should go home. This was fun. <laughs> Thanks. Me too. I'll text you and look forward to, to the next time. Look, I don't know how to say this, but I'm into you. I have big decisions coming up, and even just your friendship would mean a lot. I'm here for you. I know you are. Thank you, Big Papa. 
I'll text you. Night. He lets himself out. Later. God damn it. That thing again. Your eyes open on the weird slip of paper from the other day. Eyes happen. You wonder if maybe it's somehow a phone number. It could be. You pull out your phone number and enter. Four. Five. Five. You try a theory after entering seven digits. It rings. Did I do it? <laughs> Hello? I solved your riddle. You have the wrong number, dude. Yep. <laughs> they hang up on you. You decide to try again tomorrow. Damn it. All right, let's make this. Oh, let's make the design first. I'll print this. Damn it. I need three wire. And five square. Cookie time. Cookie time. What's up, Yuri? Welcome to the stream. Yay, the cookies. Bounce it right off his shoulder. Um, cultist robes. Sure. Valkyrie band. That sounds cool. Ooh, it's a helmet. Royal crown. Oh my god, that was a lot of. Oh boy. All right, we're just gonna go from the beginning here. Knock out what we can do. What is that? Those one of 65. Oh, that's the number of things I need for it? No. Oh, it's the items. Oh my god. There's 65 things I can make. Once upon a time, a girl loved bugs. Someone's a bug ally. I want to try that. That sounds adorable. How long do they stay with me? That's a lot of messages. Oh my god. Uh, I have so much left over. Vegan cheese everywhere. And I'm sick of grilled sandwiches. I thought my plans was foolproof. But here I am. Approved fool. Let's cook something else. <laughs> yes, I'll be right there. Okay. Sorry arrives a few minutes later. Hi, uh, you wanna... Is it... I mean, can I... Let's get cooking. So what are we cooking today, chef? I brought all the leftover cheese. Uh, mac and cheese? Whoa. Brilliant! I knew I could count on you. By the way, this cooking thing isn't just a flirting tactic. I mean, it's that too. I tried googling cheese recipes, but they all have the complex, these complex instructions. Uh. I even looked at a few for mac and cheese, but they required a roux. <laughs> One of them had like 50 photos of a vacation to Austria for some reason. Too intense. I probably could have figured it out myself eventually, but I haven't really been sleeping. Too much stress? Uh -huh. You could say that. It's stressful having raccoons living in your dorm vans. What? Well, and I guess summer finals are coming up soon too, so... And I'm starting to wonder about everything. It's not a warm and fuzzy feeling. Even if I get straight A's, am I wasting the peak years of my life going into debt? Probably. And for what? I'm studying history, burying my nose in the past while the future burns. What would you rather do? No idea. I've been excited about so many things and then none of them worked out. I love playing video games, but that doesn't mean I want to make them. Mm. If I quit school, maybe I could do something to really change the world. Do it. Volunteer for the next mayor's election campaign, maybe. If I wait until after I graduate, I'm being selfish while people suffer. But you're the coolest person I know, and you graduated college, so what do you think? Would you make the same decisions if you could go back in time? Hmm. Follow your heart. Yeah, I would if I could. I don't even know what my heart wants. Except, I know I'm drawn to you. With your support, I feel like I can do anything. Hell yeah, dude. Ooh. Glaive's throw goes farther. Immobilize lasts longer. I thought I already had this. Even fight a boss battle like mac making mac and cheese. I know I helped last time, but maybe this time I should just watch. I mean, if I touch it, I'll just ruin it. I believe in you. Huh? You, you do? Wow. Well, 
I can't disappoint you then. Sawyer beams with excitement. Fists clench, or fists clench, and they power. Are they powered up? Let's do this! I fucking love you. Careful with the knives. Okay, chef. Yeah. He helps Sawyer follow the steps for baked mac and cheese with breadcrumbs. Delicious. I'm actually hungry now. Soon enough, you're eating the fruits or starches of your labor. That's funny. <laughs> I love mac and cheese. So gooey. So comforting. Fuck, I could go for some mac and cheese. This is actually better than Russian food. How? You're like the dream of a boyfriend. The dream of a boyfriend. Sexy, kind, and a great cook. Wow. Let's oh. realize we have leftovers for breakfast. This is the best. But it's getting a bit late. I should get some sleep before exams tomorrow. Raccoons are not. Can I give you... Nothing. You decide not to give you... Yeah, but... So, um, I don't mean to be a burden or in the way... And I feel weird asking, but... I can't help think it would be so red. Can I sleep over tonight, please? You're precious. It's, it's okay to say no and change your mind. Really, this isn't a B&B. &B. Oh, boy. Nah, if I, if it's me, I let people have, like, the bed. And I'll take the couch if they want. The couch is yours. Yay, you're the best. I'll just snuggle down and not be a bother. But can I have a kiss goodnight? Only a kiss? Only a kiss. All right. The weird world fades away and you share a sweet, heartfelt kiss. Soon is over. You put a blanket, a throw a blanket over them, and they're snoring within a moment. God, I wish I could do that. You go to bed. In the morning, they're rushing late for class. Crap. Got a jet. Thanks again, Bye. chef. Have a good day, Sawyer. Sawyer gives you a hesitant, shy kiss goodbye. Their lips warm on your cheek. The door closes softly behind him. Hi. Your eyes happen on the weird you slip of paper again. You still wonder if it could be a phone number. You pull out your phone and enter a... What's the L at the end? That's a seven. I'm convinced it's the upside down numbers. One, two. The numbers changed. There was two upside down fives. Or I fucked up last time. Or. How do you know if the zero is upside down? Five. Or the eight. Five. You try theory. Who is this? Fuck! I haven't figured that thing out yet. Uh-oh. What'd you do, Sawyer? Also, I forgot to check. I got new stuff. If vampires existed, they'd wear this, probably. <laughs> I like my outfit. What about my hats? Ooh. See further. Overpriced, but capitalism comes for us all. Enemies bleed when they damage you. Yeah. Ooh! See further. Is that actually a thing? Definition of classy like RZ Cola. Doubles all damage. Ready for Valhalla or the catwalk. Hell yeah, let's go. Doubles all damage. It's gonna hurt. Oh god, that's too many messages. Help, urgent. Is Cow Cow... Uh, Cow Cow's other title... What is Cow Cow's other title besides Chancellor? Uh... I know who they're talking about. No time, please, Kaka's other title. Emperor Haughty, Emperor... Emperor Da of Wu. Shit, now my brain is... I think it's Emperor Da of Wu. Kao Kao's Wu. I think. Thanks! I guess we'll find out. Hey, I keep seeing something called Blade Generation everywhere. All I know is it's really popular. Be my youth culture interpreter. What is it? Unless it's some kind of sex thing, then don't tell me. It's a band. Oh, okay. Well, if you find a CD of theirs, bring it home so I can listen. I don't want to fall completely out of touch, you know. Thanks, honey. Thanks, sploosh. What the fuck? 
Wait, are you- is that sploosh or are you sweating? It's been a while since we've sparred. My office has been quiet lately. How about a fencing lesson here? On guard! Alright. Hey, tell me if I get too clingy, right? Sure. I promise. Oh my god! Cool, I don't want to take your friendship for granted. Talk to you later, Kate. Sounds good. It's time. Let's dance. Again? On my way. Cheers. Hey, can I ask you something? Want to join me? Join when I paint my new mural. You can be... Absolutely! Fuck! I don't like any of these options. I want to say absolutely. I don't care if Jake's there or not. I don't care if it's illegal. I don't like any of these options. Is it illegal? Well, it shouldn't be. What do you say? Sounds good. Wow, really? Wow, nice. Midnight Museum. Wear dark clothes, seriously though, black. Is she actually serious? What if I show up in the beret that she gave me? Enemies get stunned when they damage you. <laughs> oh, I hate that outfit. I'm gonna wear the beret. See if she likes it. Oh, there's someone else here. The museum looks deserted when you reach it. In the dark, it looks somehow for foreboding. It's quiet. Too quiet. You shiver involuntarily. Maybe that's why you nearly jump out of your skin when a hand descends on your arm. Another hand covers your mouth as you're pulled down an alley. <laughs> oh, I like you even more now. Woo! Give me the vapors. Shh, it's just me. Startled me. The Roses of Venus have been doing graffiti for years. I've been doing this for years. You're in good hands. I promise this is going to be fun. Um... Valeria smiles crookedly, her eyes glinting in the half-light. You look... You're just so... Um... Look good. Thanks. On nights like this, I feel real wild, free, full of abandon. Do you like my hat? Can't you feel it? Like there's something fast moving through you? Like you want to turn yourself inside out to show the world all the wonder inside you. That sounds awesome. She pulls you in her arms with another word, and you can hear her breathing. God, I love the way you smell. Okay. Her lips touch your collarbones, the hollow at your throat. Are you gonna bite me? Mm hmm. And the way you taste. Okay, this is getting awkward. By the time she reaches your lips, you've forgotten your own name while you're here. Val Valerius foot jostles the black devil bat at her feet and then jangles. She springs back with a hiss and glances around. Don't think anyone heard that. Lucky. She casts you a rueful look. We should focus on Roses of Venus business. Ever bring anyone else? Uh uh. Another civilian, you mean? No, you're my first. Jess brought her fine art professor at college to one of her murals once. She tried to convince her to accept it as a final project. Ha, <laughs> did it work? Not at first, but Jess convinced her. Wow, cool. She's good at convincing people to do things for her. Larry hefts the bag over her shoulder and points towards the wall of the museum. This is a good wall. See how nice and smooth it is? I've already primed it with satin paint. It takes up color better that way. She zips open the bag, revealing an array of spray paint cans, paint brushes, and paint. Pick a color for me. I need inspiration. Uh, ooh, I like jade green and orchid, pur orchid purple. Mm. Purple's royalty, but it's more than that. It's mystery. Maybe even a little bit magical. Valeria hefts the paint you chose, juggling it from one hand to another. Yeah, we level up! Uh, there we go. Uh, can attack in the middle of a roll. Sick! Her face is thoughtful, almost preoccupied. She turns to look at you, and her eyes. For a moment, you feel almost alone, as though Valeria isn't with you. As if the world around you is tissue thin, beneath is, is something blazes with color. And just as quickly, the moment huh? is gone. Did you feel that? Her voice sounds shaky, not sure what you're 
voice will sound like when you say it. Yes? I wish I could say that's never happened before. But right now, we have a job to do. She marks the surface of the wall, dividing it up into halves, then quarters. After a moment's hesitation, Valeria hands you a paint can. <laughs> You're my muse, aren't you? Paint something. Like what? Just let the wall speak to you. That's what I do. You take a deep breath and lift the paint can in your hand. And the sounds of sirens tear through the night air all around you. Oh, shit! She grabs her bag in your free hand and begins to run. The voice hisses softly from nearby shadow. Shit! Valentine, over here! Huh? This way! Oh, it's you. I thought it was going to be the snake person. Jake, what are you doing here? Saving your asses. What the hell do you think I'm doing here? Did you call the cops? <sighs> hey, listen, buddy. I may not like you, but I'm not going to call the cops on you. Wait, why don't you like me? There's no reason. You're just jealous. This is a roses of... Oh, I don't need that. This is Rose's Venus job, and I'm still a Rose. I'm here to help. Huh. Come on, Valentine, I'm on your side. I took your side against my own sister. And Big Papa, whatever's between you and me, I'd never betray Val. I believe him. A siren sounds far too close for comfort. You want us all to get arrested? We need to go. Fine. We all start running, following Jake, three silhouettes flying down the alleys. Alley. Soon you leave the signs behind, they only sound your own breathing and the crunch of gravel. You can't stop your hands from shaking for some time, even after you arrive home. That's it? You wake up. God, that fucking piece of paper. One more try. You pull out your phone and enter a... Two. Oh. Seven. You aren't in each number that's right side up. Finally! I've been waiting. I solved your riddle! It's Rowan! That's their name. Come to my house. I forgot the voice I gave them. Come to my house when you have a moment. I have a use for you. I hang up. Okay. Whew. It's a good thing Jake was there, unless he did call the police. That was close. Oh, I gotta change my clothes back. Um, let's go with the Valkyrie. Is there anything that double experience? That sounds dope. I want those other plushies. Who's this? This is the cat. The cat said, "Go to the Marie." Yeah, you find Pocket sitting outside the Verona Beach Museum. He's looking at you unexpectedly. Hey, what's up? He flicks his tail nonchalantly. His fur looks less... Looks freshly clean and brushed. Do you want... I have nothing for you. You decide not to give a gift right now. The door opens suddenly. Pocket jumps out of the way, eyes wide with curiosity. Oh, fuck off. Oh, if it isn't the elusive bib, Papa. What luck, I want to discuss our next date. Not getting one. Pocket suddenly on full alert, as if someone had stepped on his tail. God, stand back, big Papa. I know this cat. He is a dangerous wild beast. Ugh. Eric tries to kick at Pocket, but the cat sprints past. Fuck you, dude. I'll kick you. I do not allow dirty animals in places of sophistication. Not your problem, you hate cats. Never hurt him. Yep. Eric clenches back from your fury. You imagine his tail would be between his legs if he had one. You rush past him into the museum lobby. You enter just in time to see Pocket's tail disappear into the prehistoric exhibit. You follow, browsing the dinosaur bones and it's surreptitiously checking nooks and crannies. Eventually, you find him gazing at a saber-toothed cat skeleton the size of a panther. Study the skeleton. You take a moment to admire the skeleton's preserved ferocity from test to tail. The label reads, Smilogen Fatalis, excavated in Verona Beach, California State Fossil. Pocket releases a small, wheezing sigh at the Smilodon. Is this your role model? Is this your great-grandma? Adorable. Um... Yeah, see, I already had these. How does it rank up if it's already there? Pocket blinks in surprise and stares again at the Smilogen skeleton with wider eyes. 
He takes a deep breath, chest expanding with apparent power and confidence. Pocket turns on his heel, grimly walking back to the lobby. Security guards approach and he loses his cool, scampering out and down the street. He browses the rest of the exhibit before heading home. God damn it. Your cat is getting us in trouble. Yo, what the hell happened? Pocket's acting really weird. He's more educated. Well, I wish he'd stop attacking my feet. <laughs> my slippers are destroyed, jeez. That's funny. Oh, let's go. I gotta learn about Ramona. Or, what's her name? Ramon. Ramon. Ramon? Rowan. You find Rowan waiting outside the mansion. They give you a brief oh. nod. I suppose you wanted me to invite you in for tea. Because people do that. Why do you send a riddle? I like tea. Good. Then you will help me gather brewing surprise. I was going to go look for an herb on the mountain. Crowley thought you might want to help. The bird looks at you pointedly from Rowan's shoulder. Crowley is a crow. Nice to meet you, Crowley. Crowley bobs his head and clicking Pretty his beak. Human. If he vouches for you, then that's good enough for me. Let's get going. Uh... I don't know herbs. Hmm. And try to be useful in some other way. At least don't slow us down. They start walking off towards the hills. You walk together along a narrow trail in silent companionship. Here. Alice once found Laurel Sumac and Black Sage here somewhere. Since you said you're ignorant of botany. <laughs> uh. Listen. Don't get any wild ideas. I need you to do something. Please. Just rest here. Right on this rock. I'll be right back. I'll chat with Crowley. No. <laughs> He's coming with me. We'll handle this. Stay put. Oh! Maybe he wants to hang out with me. They wait in the underbrush, underbrush without looking back. They wait for a while. The breeze is soft and the sun is warm. The guy can only take so much breeze and sun. You start feeling antsy. I'll gather some wildflowers. Hey, I got a flower crown. You gather flowers from nearby and weave them together into a chain. As you, fin as you finish, Rowan returns. You want this? No. Some days they feel more feminine, but not today. You have some skill with your fingers. That much is clear. I found the laurel stomach, but the black, not the black sage. I wonder. Do you want? Some eyeshadow? Oh, yeah. Is this your way of saying I should attempt a bit more glamour? You're probably <sighs> right. Oh well, it's too late anyway. What do you wonder? No. It doesn't matter. I have to face this. It's just me now. Hey, Papa, I have something important to ask you. I'm yeah, so very confused. March! Welcome to the stream. How you doing? We got a new boyfriend. He's a scythe. Heavy finishers create temporary gravity well. Ooh. If you were to wield me, what would be your end goal? Uh, can we just get to know each other first? Love. Rowan laughs darkly. Flattery comes so easily to your silver tongue, like music to a songbird. Did you not like that? They lead you down the mountain, silent in thought. At the edge of town, they pull a black rectangle from their pocket. Our dark, our dark prisms are connected. They poke their prism, and your phone vibrates. Oh. Their eye catches on the flower. Their eye catches on your flower chain. And their lip quick. Whoa. Their eye, their eyes catch on your flower chain, and their lips quirk briefly into a quiet smile. Okay. I don't know if our purpose is lying quite, but call on me if souls need harvesting. Farewell. Farewell Goodbye. for now. Bye, bird. I like this person. I'm doing just fine. A uh, little bit stressed today, but we're dealing. You're just all right. Did you have a stressful day? 
You doing okay? You go to the shop for when you go home. Cool, we got a new weapon. Our journey has begun. We are the fool. Yep, I'm a fool. You're the fool. Next, the magician. I don't get his limericks. Indeed. Though I've lost my high priestess, I don't know what he's referencing. Hey, so I'm really very sorry for how I acted when we met. I was really emotional and I took it out on you, and that was wrong. Please, can you forgive me? Forgive me. Thank you. Godspeed. Rowan gives me weird feelings. Don't want to do things that need to be done? Dude, same. I am so very behind on so many things. I felt like doing absolutely nothing today. Can you, uh, take some time for yourself and maybe get some rejuvenated rejuvenation? Rejuvenated? I can words. Looks like the Los Angeles Ballet Company has come to town. These are so fucking expensive. They're for Italian opera. Um, doomed lovers. I don't want to buy these. They're so expensive. Let's go buy some stuff if I can. I need those squares. I needed a few of those. I needed like 50 or something. There we go. Oh, I can buy these. Why not? Buy them. Oh god, there's a lot of them. Alright, we're buying them all. Why does it automatically go back to the top? That's obnoxious. Okay. Thank you. Have a good day. Can I go make stuff now? You haven't been sleeping a lot? Oh, dude. You doing okay? Like, not sleeping? You don't have motivation? It's just like a spiral. And it fucking sucks. If you need anything, reach out. Dark eyeliner. Woo! Business suit. Polar hat. Whoa! Oh, crap. I was buying that shit for the signs. It's fine. There it is. I need 11 sugar. Why is the KDA song playing? I'm gonna get DMCA'd! Stop! Blah, 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 blah. Apparently I got, I have a new KDA wallpaper that has music with it. All right, I need 11 sugar, which I couldn't buy. I don't think I could buy the wire. I need 10 wire. Cookie time. Okay, I need a bunch of cloth. Let's go get that real quick. Also, I heard cookie time. Get the cookies! Get them cookies. Boop. Get a summer depression sneaks up. And I, I understand. Mine always happens in, uh, like winter. But yeah. Hit me up if you ever need anything. I spent $150 on cloth. How come you don't have any wire or sugar? Oh shit, I didn't need to do that. I have 50 of those. It's fine. Where can I buy sugar?
No, this is... It's not a shot. My money is still counting down. Do I just do the normal dungeon then? To get more sugar? Alright, what do you want? Oh, it's a date. The music is dark and coppery tonight. Coppery? Is that a... Is that a word to describe music? Coppery? Flavored with industrial tones. Thunder returns from a break outside with a wild glint in his eyes. I just showed up and he got all excited. Bleeding enemies... Wait, wait. Bleeding enemies do less damage. Don't care. Bleeding enemies move slower. Okay. It means it gains ferocity and speed as you dance. Eventually, the night draws to, close, draws to a close and the club empties. You stumble outside. I, we didn't even talk. The crowd of loiterers smell smells like gin and cigarette smoke. A scream pierces the chatter. A drunk man. Oh my god, someone called 911. People gather around something on the ground. Oh shit, is he dead? I don't know, man. That's messed up, man. Go home, people. It's all right. An ambulance is already on the way. I don't have the energy for this tonight. Just take care of it. Yes, sir. Thunder stalks away towards Kick's Cafe. All right, later, dude. That's the bouncer for info. The ambulance is on its way. Sender will pay for it from his tab. More than that, I can say, you'll have to ask him. Or I can't say. You go to the cafe. Okay, I followed him anyway. The cafe smells like coffee and buttered pastries. Mm. Um, welcome. That, that's your one friend, right? We're closing soon, so hurry it up. She waves you nervously towards Sunder, who's lounging in the hey. corner. Hey. He seems distracted uh, and restless. There's something I haven't told you yet. You're a vampire. I don't really know how to put this, but if you don't like me afterwards, I guess that's fine. Take your time. Okay, thanks. I'm not sure how to explain it, but you know how sometimes you have a craving for, like, chocolate. Mm. And then some people are made of and some people are made of chocolate. That's not right. Hmm. No, this isn't working. Okay, let me start over. Once there was a beautiful princess who promised a young man he could live forever. Hey. Speak of the devil. Hey, Mandy. <laughs> right? How's my timing? Uh... Uh, uh, yeah, perfect, Mandy. Hey. Messy meal tonight, huh? Should have brought a bib. <sighs> Wait, you came here just to rub it in? Fine. Big Papa, listen up. He'll be here all night if he tells it. I'll, so I'll just tell you. Sunder's 200 years old. We use blood transfusions to stay, stay young. Wait, you're vampires? Mm -hmm. Yep. Sunder shrugs it off. <laughs> See? Being up front makes it easier. Not like Big Papa is a vampire hunter. Vampire shmampire. Uh. Jeez. I can't imagine why I'd want to pretend to be a good boyfriend instead. Uh, whatever. Time to go, Sunder. Leave your playmate to think about eating your food. Hey! <laughs> That's true, though. Don't be ridiculous. I'd never eat Big Papa. He's special. Wait, so the people you bite aren't special? I'm a vampire, vampiric sword, not a monster. You should just know what you are, kiddo. You should just own what you are, kiddo. All of it. Denial is a bad look. Hey, Papa, don't listen to her, okay? I'll text you. I still... I want this to work. Aww. Somehow. Don't pressure. You kept a pretty big secret, so give him time to adjust. Thunder leaves, eyes downcast. Don't get me wrong, Big Papa. The problem isn't just this, that Thunder's a vampire. So it can't help that you smell like dinner. But the main problem is that he's a selfish, he's selfish and fickle. I'd use this whole thing as an excuse to get far away. Here's something to remember, Spy. She hands you a small pouch. It smells sinful. Ew. Thanks. Can I be a vampire? <laughs> Mandy leaves without answering. All right. I was making things. Summer dress. Adorable. Compact and monocle. Noble dress. Sugar. Wire. Wire. Sugar. Wire. Wire. Sugar, wire. Oh my God, most most everything needs sugar and wire now. 
A DIY. I did not read fully erector. I read a DIY erection. A DIY erection set with lasers. Great an allied turret. Okay, we have to play with that one too, but I want to see what this bug is. There's Bougie, and then there's you. Carry more beverages, but fewer zines. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, carry more zines, but fewer beverages. I wish you could preview these. Let's stick with that. We're going to keep with the, the Valkyrie thing. Just because I can. Alright, who else? Oh, right. Well, hello. You seem to be getting the hang of parrying, so today we'll try the repost. After a parry, your repost lets you return and ret return and return. I misread that. He glances at the door, then back to you. Hmm. Yeah, it's easier if I show you. Go ahead and attack me. Lunge! Isaac deflects easily. He leans straight into his foil, pressing into your shoulder. The more aggressive the attack, the more vicious the repost. A repost turns the attacker's energy back upon them. Mm -hmm. Isaac glances at the clock. Here, I'll attack you. Harry and then step forward and attack immediately. Are you okay? Uh... No. Yes. Yes, I think so. I don't know. You're very perceptive. I'm sorry. I'm distracted, indeed. He takes off his gear and pours refreshments. <sighs> my father has finished a hostile takeover of my firm. He bought a majority and discredited me with the board. So, my time is just about over at Brooks Associates. That's fucked. I only have today and tomorrow. I try not to care what he thinks. He's a foolish, close-minded old man. <gasps> I've officially disowned him and cut off contact. But now, I'm going to lose everything I've built here. Because of him. How can I not care? I'm sorry your dad is garbage. I kind of want to say that. That sounds right. frustrating. Yes, it is. Deeply so. But I'm really glad I talked to you. I'm sorry to burden you. Wider finisher damage area. Reduced charge time for heavy attacks. I guess it's our last time fencing in this office. Tomorrow is my last day. I sold my stock. I'll be comfortable while I sort out what to do next. I'll be a, it'll be a bit like starting over. I've lost so much. I keep trying to focus on fencing, but it's not working. Maybe I should give up for the day. Or I can make a house call for a uniquely talented fencing student like you. Why not tonight? Well, it's tempting to want to get close to you any way I can. But your temptation might be too strong for me right now. I know I'm not in a great place emotionally right now, and I dream about you. Uh, At least you're forthright and honest about it. I need to know we're committed to each other before we can be intimate. Otherwise, I'll just regret it afterwards. And I don't want to re regret anything with you. Understood. But don't worry. I promise I'm not trying to rush you. I'm just being clear about my requirements. I can respect that. Take your time and think about it. He leans in and gives you a long kiss. I suppose this is a good night for now. Thank you for your companionship. Later, Isaac. I've been dreaming about you. That's not how it goes, but it sound, it fits. Um, any more dates? What about Ramona? Ramona? Why can't I remember their name? Drive me nuts. Is this where I go for the sugar? I don't remember. Let's go here and get, see if this is where I go for sugar and wire. Everyone should have... Oh! Robin. There we go. We're going to play with Robin.
Forward. Let us be the chariot together. Whoa! Sick. Dude, he's so cool. Oh, sugar, thank you. Oh, I disappear? Yo! My dash is a disappear move. That's dope. I got distracted by the disappear move. All right. I need to summon my bugs. Damn it. You're maxed already. Ooh. Hello. Oh, can't get in there. I really need to stop bringing my powerful ones to the low levels. Oh, there was a fucking dude there. Dude, the range on that is disgusting. Good job, kitty. Oh, yes. Give me that sugar. Give me that sugar. This is going to take forever. Oh, this is actually going to take forever. Yeah, I like Rowan too. He's... Interesting. Like the, the awkward mystery thing puts me off a little bit. But he's got the, the hot eye cover thing going on for him. The hair cover eye thing. He's got that thing. Ooh. Oh, I should have bought the sugar. It's fine. Ooh, get wrecked. Cat. Pretty sure we already did this one with you. Hmm. Yep. Hmm. Dogs are the best. But I love oh. all animals. Oh yeah, because he said that about snakes. Oh, 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 oh. Um. Less sneaker than barefooters. Do you want these? Hell yeah, dude. These are simply perfection, Big Papa. I adore them. Thank you. I can break this. I'm God. Oh, you can do it to the ranged weapons, too. That's kind of cool. Ranged weapons, ranged attacks. That's what I meant to say. That's awesome. Any sugar? Let's go down uh, the shop, see if I can buy some more crap.
Oh, I missed the whole section over here. I love it when you call me Big Pop. Exactly. Ow. I got a DIY erection set that we need to try next. I'm excited. Hi, friends. Uh, hmm? I already bought one of those. Oh. Shit. I already own that. I have to buy it again? That's uncool. Really? Fine. Hold oh, still. All right, when things actually, this area might not get difficult because it's the beginning area. How do I know what level I'm on f level four? Holy crap, that hit him from that far away. <gasps> Wire! Love it. Want some ice cream? Hmm. Hmm? Oh, I didn't have you here before. Shit. I think I'll have an apricot gelato. What flavor would you like? Same! Actually, choco fudge. <laughs> A sweet tooth, hmm? A sweet tooth, hmm? I remember, I'll remember that. Oh, this reminds me of Rome. The sun on the pi piazza. A taste of apricot. Have you ever been to Italy? They have fantastic fencers in Rome. Top notch. Perhaps we can go, go to a match together sometime. Want some lipstick? Hey, you like the gloves. Beautiful as yet practical. The perfect kind of gift. Thank you. For now, however, practice must resume. Oh, I didn't need that. Ooh, money! Money for me, ah! Say hello to my crab! I mean, my... My bug. Look at him go! Look at my bug friend. I love him. How long do you last? Is it for this whole floor? Maybe I should use you more. Oh, goodness me. Come on, bug friend. Bug friend's name is Gilbert. Come on, Gilbert. I like the little, <laughs> his little walking sound. Do seven next. Huh. Break down that door. Does I already own it? Nope. Heck you, telephone. Get him, bug! Wow, we mur- I didn't even need to summon my bug. I just murdered him straight up. Okay, then. I didn't even need to do a power attack. <laughs> that was my normal attack. Switch my weapon. Where'd my bug go? Did I accidentally kill my own bug? That's dumb. Hey. Oh, I remember this mall now. I've been here before. I've been living in Seoul since I was eight. But I still have some memories. Growing up in VB, this fountain was my favorite. 
We didn't have money to shop with, but I would take off my shoes and play. I miss that, just being a kid, you know? Not worrying about how you look. I guess that's stupid to think about. You can never go back. Hell yeah, take off your shoes and play. You splash them with water. Stop. Stop. Thanks, I appreciate the sentiment, but not right now. I'm done here. Can we go? Dang it, man. Do you want... You, you like this stuff? Thank you. I've been wanting one of these. Sven... Or Sven, I keep calling him Sven. Seven. Seemed like a cool dude, but... I don't think we jive, man. Too serious. Oh, there was a secret door there that I totally saw. Really? Doesn't pick them all up automatically? Do we need that? Yes. I'm not a rich pop star like you. Ooh, I need that too. He might be maxed out after this one. I'm just here for sugar. Leave me alone. Are you done? Look at all that wire. Dodging your shit. Nope. Well, take that though. Vampire phones. They suck your life out of you. That's true though. You want to like hang out? Like seriously. I think it might be, like, a great idea. You shares aren't worth the money or the time. God, you're so boring! They're just trying to rip off people who can't afford a real massage. Ugh. They're basically a different kind of dungeon monster. Evil vibration monsters. You hate them that much? Huh? Who, me? I don't care that much. I mean, they're just chairs. People are just people. Nothing matters, really. Do I have anything else for you? You like this book? Perfect for reading on the plane. Thanks, Big Papa. He kicks the side of the massage chair half-heartedly. It doesn't budge. Whatever. Cool. So he's done. On God, all you uglies! Got him. Ooh. There's a sneaky boy. I don't think we need to finish off this bit because I'm done with leveling him, but it, I guess I level myself, right? Ooh, challenge room for me. Come at me. Get blapped. Woohoo, and got nothing. Ding ding, motherfucker. Wire for me. Present for me. Just kick the safe open. Alright, cool. We're gonna be done with seven. Uh I think we're gonna do Sawyer next. Let's do Sawyer. I 
forgot what my uh throw attack does. Oh, it finds him. Hey, ow! Oh my god, almost murdered me. Bug friend! Get him, Gilbert! That almost killed Bug friend! Oh my god. Not strong at all. Secrets. Oh, I didn't mean to pick that up. All right, let's not pick that up. Get him, Gilbert. I can have multiple, bro. Gilbert army. Amazing. Incredible. Oh, bug army. Actual amazing. Oh shit, now I want to switch for those things that I get less heals but more zines. I could just have a huge ass bug. Oh, yes, let's play a game! Absolutely. Oh, cool, I love video games! That's why you took me here, right? Wait, what even are these? Wait, is that Driving Mania? Whoa! That came out in 1998. That was before I was born. These are relics. Ancient. Cool, right? That makes me feel old. Wait, how old are you? <laughs> cool, right? Yeah. yeah! I mean, it's like a car enthusiast getting to drive a Model T. Or I guess maybe that's Pong. This would be something later. I don't really know cars. <laughs> Sawyer's precious. But whatever, let's play! Hell yeah. Your virtual cars race around the tracks. You get the sense Sawyer's going easy on you. Race flirtily. Race seriously. Yeah. We're gonna flirt. We're gonna, we're gonna smash into him. Why do you keep bumping my car? Oh, huh? Um. You play for a while, eventually you run out of tokens. Do you want... Travel guide? Yeah! Oh, I can't wait to be done with school and start traveling. Thanks! GG, now I'm revved up for duty. I love Sawyer. Where did all my bugs go? Oh, they disappeared temporarily. How big of an army can I have? Holy shit. Every time I pick up, excuse me, bugs. Oh no. The one downside of having a bug army. No, let me out. Let me out. Oh my God. Maybe I shouldn't <laughs> do bugs every time I pick up a Zine. You can do that, it's fine. Stay away from my bugs. I got no bugs. Move, I need the sugar, thank you. I think there was another down I could have gone, but it's fine. No, I don't have any bugs. Really? Half my life? Bug one. Bug two. Oh, you're in trouble now. I was gonna be able to buy something from that. Ah! Sneak phones. Dang it, I'm out of bugs. I gotta remember that. I have this. Ooh. Double present. Love that for me. Hello. A box and a fabric. Probably not worth it. Ooh. I'll take that though. 16 cents? Hell yeah. Ah! Oh, we were at 6.9. Temporarily. Oh, the bugs are back! Okay, that's, that's big. I'm glad they do that. Yes! Bug army. Come on, bugs. Don't get locked out. I 
They're getting stuck. The game has found out my cheesiness. <laughs> oh, this is a nice rink. Yeah, let's, let's hang out here. Sawyer's face brightens at the sight of the ice. I've never been ice skating before. Let's do it. Be careful. Yeah, yeah, I'll be careful, Dad. Let's do it, Daddy. They both put on skates and wobble out onto the ice. Sawyer falls over a few times, but gets back up quickly. Eventually, they're out of breath, but with a smile. Thanks for the new experience. I feel like I leveled up. Do I have anything else for you? Got some shoes? Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, cool sneakers. I like it a lot. Thanks, Big Papa. I heard Verona Beach has an Olympian ice skater. Maybe I'll take a lesson sometimes. But for now, it's fighting time. I kind of thought the sneakers would be for uh, Valeria, but also I guess it kind of makes sense that they're not. Bugs, please don't get in my way. No! Oh, spitting that money. That's too many of those things chucking stuff at me. Five bugs. Ouch. Move. Six bugs. <laughs> I have to go around in such a wide arc to get around him. All right, change weapon. We're going to do Sunder next. Mammy. Ah. Easy. Ah! Too many TVs. Rot your brains. Oh, that's right. I'm doing double damage. No wonder stuff's just dying. And no wonder everything hurts like a freaking. It's me like a freaking Mack truck. Oh, hey. Sure, we'll do this again. I don't know if I did it with Sunder before, so. Sunder watches a waterfall, mesmerized. Would you like to have a gift? Uh. The malt skunk? Oh, God. Top shelf, huh? I didn't know you were a dr drink snob, but I'll roll with it. <laughs> the sound of water is almost musical. Not very good for dancing, though. More like trance. You think they have a music store? I guess those really don't exist anymore. Mm. The malls aren't popular anymore, either. And here we are. So anything's possible. Oh, well. Let's keep going. Dude, the daggers in the cat claws will probably do a million and a half damage. Especially the daggers, because you can make it make crits happen. Sounds awesome. Stay away! <gasps> Look at those wires, I need them. Oh weird. First time I had that kind of weird layout. Giant hole in the ground. I miss some. I did. I missed some sure. It was worth it. It's worth it just to go back for that two seconds. Uh, next level. Uh, I don't have any more bug friends. Woo! Aw, rude. Oh my god, everything sneaked up on me and scared me. Ouch. That hurt. Let's 
Sneaked up on me, snuck up. I think that's the proper way to English. This is goofy lo-fi. What's this little clock thing that pops up there? Ice cream! So peaceful I can imagine making out here. Sometimes they're just a little too yeah. obvious. Mm, ice cream. Mm, no thanks. Maybe you should try freezing blood sometime. Mm. Why do you think people come to the mall anyway? It's so sterile. Spend time together. <laughs> That's a sweet thought. I don't... I know I wouldn't come here without you, after all. All the more reason to clean out these monsters. Let's get back to it. Okie dokie. Oh my god. TVs are everywhere. Spitting out that vile magics into your eyeballs. What do we got down here? Dang it. Not enough. Maybe it's because I'm in like baby level. Them and they're not getting much experience. Oh, a lot of things spawning on top of me. Bugs, bugs. I can ask two bugs. Ooh, a lot of things. Coming out of nowhere. Oh, break? Aw, oh, bummer. Ooh, sugar. Thank you. That hit me. <laughs> they attacked the thing. The life in it. Good job, little bugs. Bug! Bug! Uh. Bug! Oh, no. Excuse you. Excuse you. Thank you. Not even worth it. Everyone out this way, say woohoo! So I can sneak by. Didn't we already do this break with you? I don't recall. Nothing but massage to loosen up all those tight muscles. You both sit in the massage chairs, they begin to vibrate and need your back. Mm hmm. You relax into the massage. You send us over. Oh, yeah. Have another one. Round two! Yep. Um. I don't think I have it. Actually, no. Do I. I wonder if I actually have to save that, like, love note for the person I want to romance officially. <gasps> Six bugs! How many can I have? I wonder if it'll stop dropping signs. <gasps> Seven bugs! Got my answer immediately. When will it stop dropping signs? I'm just gonna keep summoning these bug army let me through let me through let me through let me through i can't tell there's too many things happening too many bugs there's some wire i want that <gasps> excuse you ah sneaky bugger Dude, there's poison. No, I lost all my bug friends. I wish you got like half of them back or something. Change weapon. All right, we got cat and Valeria. Let's get cat because it's a level behind Valeria. Woo. Cat messing them up. Ooh, like that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ooh. Holy crap. Bug. Ooh, sugar. Ooh, cat statue, look. You try showing Pocket the sculpture, he doesn't seem to notice it. You wonder if it's too big in size for him to see it's a cat. I'm gonna pet the sculpture. You reach up to pet the sculpture, talk to the cold metal like it's cute kitty. Pocket watches you with disinterest and you can't help but feel pity. <laughs> Do you want... Uh, you won't care about any of these. Unless I do that. <laughs> will that, will this love later get taken back to the, the owner? That'd be awkward. How did I miss it? Go away, bugs. Not my bugs. My bugs are cool. Oh crap, this thing. The bugs that keep flying in my face, tickling my nose. Look at all my bugs. Get them, bugs! Oh, almost first phased it. Woo! Go bug army. I'm the actual bug army. Be free! Bless my bugs. Or not. Excuse you, bugs. Uh, I don't want to run back all the way through the dungeon, so we'll just go. I'm a hero. Almost a vanquisher. Oh, also the cat leveled up, so that's fine. You feel a bit woozy and fatigued. A sudden sneeze interrupts your thoughts. You wonder if you're getting sick. Wait, what? Sorry about last message. What did you do? Let's make these. Fox hood. Angel costume. Shit. Kigurumi. Okay, I need one and two light crystals. Let's go do that. Uh, sorry, that was Crowley. I'm sure it was. I can buy two light crystals from this place. They're 100 bucks each. Okay, now I'm poor. Look, I've made everything. You can't hold this button. I guess. I think I've actually made everything that I can make. That's amazing. Go me. All right. Um, evoke Zeus, Thor, Set, and Arana all at once. That sounds cool. Let's get the uh, erection set. Let's play with the erection set. Um, okay. Not today, Satan. Ooh, woo. Ah, Fuck. I need it. Bomber jacket. Bomber jacket. Waiting for a night. Tired being your own night. Inspired. Hell yeah. You may not like it, but this is what your ideal body looks like. All right. Exit shows a mini map. Does it... Different soundtrack. But I like the soundtrack. You know what? We're going full angel. Oh god. Oh, that's too many messages. What's up, Rowan? Jibs blip. Sorry that was Crowley. Though I could use your help. An appraiser is coming to assess my inheritance, and I do not wish to be alone with him. Will you come? Of course. Thank you. No problem. What's up, Sawyer? Ah! Whatever that is, I'm excited for it. Sorry about my last message. I was in the middle of a test. I shouldn't have helped. I shouldn't have had you help me cheat. 
Especially since your answer was wrong. It was wrong? Fuck. He is way. Cow Cow is way. I'm an idiot. Wu is, uh... Liu Bei. I think. I got all my stuff mixed up. Yeah, I think that's right. Liu Bei is Wu. The green guys. Uh, really sorry, won't do it again. In fact, to make up for it, here's a picture of a cute dog I saw at the park. I love him. I love him. Can I save that photo? Aw. How are you? I think I have a cold. Uh, I'm good. You sniffle and cough, your throat and nose feel raw and sensitive. Story arrives after a few minutes. Cut. Whoa, you look awful. I mean, uh, you definitely have a summer cold, but check this out. Check this book of shit out. I don't know if you believe in stuff like this, but you must have a garden angel. I'm wearing a garden angel suit. What are you talking about? Just this morning, I had the sudden urge to make chicken soup. Maybe I'm a telepath. Did you burn your, down your dorm? I'm just lucky. I've had weird dreams. I'm just lucky. Well, maybe you're lucky because gods and telepaths are always looking out for you. I should probably take a class in probability. Oh, well. Look, my crown and glory, chicken food soup. A personal medicine for Big Papa's common cold. <laughs> Made with my secret ingredient, love. And MSG. I mean, I don't know. I didn't know it was for you when I was cooking it, but I'm sure it still tastes good. Can't wait. Here, let me help. You get comfortable. I'll take care of you. Oh, you're sweet. So I pours two servings of soup, and you sit down together. The soup is unusual. There's a floral scent, and the broth is gray-blue color. You should put soup food coloring in it. As you dip your spoon, the surface wobbles. There's no way this is normal chicken soup. Bon appetit! I bet you're going to love the soup, a la Sawyer. <laughs> I want to ask what it is. <laughs> It's like that uh, the deleted scene from Lord of the Rings when uh, Eowyn brings, uh, or not Boromir, uh, Aragorn the soup. <laughs> so what's in it exactly? Oh, vegetables, herbs, you know the deal. Like you taught me, I follow the recipe. Mostly anyway. Come on, dig in. Eat the soup. You bring the spoon to your lips. The floral set is stronger and slightly rotten. In a moment of bravery, you take a sip and swallow. Um, apparently I swallow. Uh, all finishers also set enemies on fire. Sick. It tastes fruity yet familiar, and the texture is chewy. A warmth spreads from your belly. Am I going to vomit? Watching you soar, his face changes into fear and dismay. You feel as if a soft golden light has wrapped itself around your shoulders. What's happening? You lose consciousness. What the fuck? Big Papa! Big Papa! You wake up feeling refreshed and energized. Soar is by your size. Oh my jeez, are you okay? I'm so sorry. I feel amazing. What happened? You passed out for about six hours. You talk a lot and you sleep. Do you know that? But I found the problem. I use cough syrup. Like a lot of it. Why the fuck did you put cough syrup in soup, Sawyer? You realize that's why the soup tasted familiar? Cough syrup. You feel like gay. <laughs> I thought it'd just add a fruity flavor. Maybe some sweetness like blueberry, blueberry syrup. Oh my god, Sawyer, you're fucking precious, but I can't eat anything that you make me. You wanna know how to break into them that blueberry syrup would also not be long in chicken soup? I can't believe- Peanut, welcome to the stream, my dude. Thank you so much for the raid. What were you playing? Um, so our friend here just made us some chicken soup. And he, uh, and, and they put cough syrup in it. And, uh, it's, they're just adorable. I love them. What, do you not know what Boyfriend Dungeon is? If you have Game Pass, it's free, and I highly recommend it. It's so much fun. And this is Sawyer, and they just made me some soup. And, uh, they wanted to add a fruity flavor to it, so they added cough syrup to it. And they couldn't decide between cough syrup and blueberry syrup. And I have to explain to them that blueberry syrup, syrup should also not in chicken soup. I mean, maybe the syrup helped. 
You look much better than before. More alive. Maybe soup all the is actually a healing potion. Even more than bubble tea. It also knocked me out. You know what? I appreciate your gumption. Well done. Of course, anytime. Anything for my bestie. I hope it's okay to call you that. They'll have to stock up on more cough syrup or blueberries while they're in season. Anyway, now that you're awake, I should go study for my last final. But first, I got you a little gift. Thank you for all the clicking lessons. I got some headphones. Hell yeah, dude. Are they matching? Go check it out in the mirror. You don't have to use them, but I thought you might have fun with headphones in the dungeon. I love them. <laughs> well, I'm sorry again that I asked you to cheat for me. I just got too worked up. Next time I'll think for your, of your disapproving face. That'll keep me on track. I'm not your dad. If you say so. I do. I want to think. I want you to think well of me because I'm a telepath, remember? Anyway, be good. Be, you be good too. Enjoy the rest of the soup. Bye. I can't promise that. They give you a quick kiss goodbye. Sawyer waves and closes the door softly, softly behind them. I love Sawyer. They are precious as fuck. What are the headphones? Different soundtrack. Oh. Nice. But I like my Valkyrie thing. Makes me blow through stuff. Ah! Too many messages! Sometimes I feel weird about being a glaive. Like I'm told that it's the best word for what I am. It just sort of just means sword. Glaive sounds cool. What about gladius? Whoa! No way I'm cool enough for that. No way I'm cool enough for that. Plus that's the name of an old video game. Though I guess glaive might also be a video game someday. Precious. I'm letting Pocket out, by the way, worried he's looking for a fight. If so, he'll win. I'll keep him safe. I hope so. Okay, Pocket's out. Good luck finding him. All right, gotta go find Pocket. Isaac. I've been dreaming about you. Zombie dreams? Evans, no. You get those? I hope not. You were healing broken weapons of all kinds. Me too. Ah, stop. I'm trying to read. It was lovely. You're comfort to me, even when I'm asleep. Thank you. Sorry I've been quiet. Time with you has been healing. Can you come to my old office, Brooks Associates? My father is officially taken over, and I want to confront him once for all. I'll be there. I can do this. Yes, you can. I mean, we can do this. You got this, my dude. I believe in you. All right, what do you want, Seven? I have a big decision to make, and I can't figure out what to do. I'm here at Paradise Lost, hoping the cats will keep me calm. I'll be there. What do you want, Sunder? Sorry I didn't tell you sooner. I was afraid you'd leave. Now you think... Now you know what I am. What do you think? I mean... I kind of don't like any of these options. Emperors are cool. Sorry. Really. I guess I'll see you in the next dungeon. Alright. As long as freaking Eric isn't messaging me, I'm happy. Where are we going? Uh, not you. Oh. Is the... Is Pocket here? Pocket! You find Pocket wandering outside the mall. You follow him, follow him until he stops in front of a pet store. He pulls something out from a hiding place under a bench and nudges it towards you. Fucking bugs! It did. He gave me cat ears. Meow. Cat ears look like they'd fit you perfectly. Pocket's ears are perked up proudly. Thanks, kitty. You think you hear a faint purring in response? And his eyes wander to the pet store's front window. There's a display of pet mice and birds available for purchase. Pocket drools. Nah, I'm not buying animals for you to eat. Pocket releases a little wheezy sigh of longing. Ah! Fuck you, cat. In what's a familiar street cat approach, Pocket tenses up claws at the ready. The street class cat slows as it gets into range of Pocket's attack, and finally just sits out of reach. Pocket's fur fluffs up with tension. He doesn't move. But he doesn't move. He doesn't know what to do. Think of the Smilden! I don't want to encourage him to fight this cat! Just hold your ground. 
The voice makes him startle and he jumps, panic in his eyes. The street cat steps forward menacingly. Pocket loses his nerve and dodges between your legs, transforming into a weapon. The street cat pauses, staring up at you and Pocket. Her tail twitches. He's not a fighter, okay? Cat doesn't understand me. But that's exactly what I'd say to a strange cat. Somehow it sounds like a solemn pron pronouncement of some kind. What is the cat saying? Huh? Olivia almost bumps into you on her way out of the pet hey. shop. Oh, hey, Big Papa. What are you doing here? With, hey, I know this cat. That's a star day. My old roommate's cat. What are you doing here, girl? She's yeah. fucked up, dude. Olivia reaches down to pet her head, but a star slinks just out of range. Ears flat. See, she's just in a bad time. She was rescued and always moody. You mean feral. You mean a jerk. You should call animal. I don't like any of these. Just let them be. Ah! You mean a jerk. A jerk with magic powers. It was like she could teleport out of locked rooms. Poor kitty. She's probably just really strong and sneaky and smart. Oh, right. I'm doing a voice. I mean, maybe she's a magical cat witch and leading a secret cat coven. Who knows? Fuck off. <laughs> anyway, have a good day, Big Papa. I'll probably see you at the kick soon, yeah? See ya. Olivia walks away in a startup. Watches for a moment before finally standing. Hi, cat. The cat wanders away after her announcement. You reach down to pet pocket and he accepts your touch. You're not sure what the cat, street cat said, but something has changed. What the fuck? Just happened. I don't speak cat. You'll briefly become invulnerable after a finisher. Dope. You realize pockets leaning into your hand and soft purring. Purr starting to crumble. Good kitty. Pocket purrs loudly, ramming his head into your leg in a surprising dis display of public affection. Do I have anything for you? Do you want some <laughs> daisies? I don't think you want any of this. Now, you send the afternoon together until Pocket gets distracted by a pigeon and runs off. You head home. Oh yeah, I got cat ears. Gotta see these. Humans' are, ears are overrated. It doesn't give me any bonus, though. Uh-oh. Someone's sending me pictures. Thunder. Uh, sucks when blood stains your good velvet. Well... Don't have a eating problem. I wouldn't know. Yeah, just thinking of you. I mean, I just wanted to talk to someone, you know. You want to eat me. You need a kiss, message anytime. I don't like any of those options. Everything is too much work, you know. The dungeon, avoiding vamp hunters, the club. There's actually vampire hunters? Gotta relax, so want to chill in the park with me? Sure. Cool, see you there. Oh my god, look how cute he is! No, no, that's the right number. What are you talking about? What do you mean wrong number? Are you flirting with someone else? I mean, it's fine. We're not in a relationship, but... Send me them cat pics! Oh, let's go help Isaac. What time is it? I don't have my phone down here. Oh, yeah, I do. It's just not on its charger. There we go. Now I know what time it is. All right, Isaac. Hello. Confront your papa. You meet Isaac outside Brooks Associates and knock on the door. You can't go in there. Oh, can't I? He just turns into a sword. That's how people threaten people in this world. Come in. The assistant shrugs and gets out of the way. Here goes. Can I really do this? I don't want to say this. I want to encourage them, but, you know, I'm going to back him up. I'm with you. Thanks. You hold his elbow and go inside together. Ah, uh, uh, Mr. Brooks, I don't believe you have an appointment. Your assistant wouldn't make me one. Why would she? Apparently, I'm not your father anymore, so you're a nobody to me. Huh. You're a piece of shit. Worse than a nobody. You're just a failure I've replaced. Want to punch in the mouth? Oh. I want to back him up, but I don't want to t uh, step on him. So I'm going to say nothing. As it gives you a grateful look and squeezes your hand. I'm just here to support, dude. 
But why are you doing this, Vincent? Why replace me at all? Even if you wanted to spite me, you must hate this. You always said jobs were for people who paid taxes. Yes, yes, but you weren't making... You were making such a mess I had to step in. My name was already on the door. This is a new low. I only came here to tell you to your face that I don't care. Yes. It's your company and I don't mind. All of my money is going to charity anyway. It was a mistake to think I could help people with venture capital. <laughs> Good. I'm so very glad that you're happy. I'm selling off this dungeon nonsense, by the way. Some Silicon Valley nutjob can have it. We'll be in... Oh, wait. It's him. We'll be investing in solid, timeless mm. products. Computers, uh, coasters, pen staplers. Are those just things you can see on your desk right now? No, I don't even own a stapler. Ha! I haven't seen a stapler in years. They must be in a hot demand. I should double my investment. <sighs> and you're just a spiteful piece of shit. You know what? It doesn't matter. I'm going to have, to have a fulfilling life with Big Papa and help people as best All I right. can. When you want to be a part of it and you can treat me with respect, you let me know. I'll squeeze his hand. Cost is more damage. Turn to leave Isaac. together. Wait, one second. I won't have you thinking this is all about you. Taking over my firm isn't about me. Well, father and son stare at each other in silence for a moment. Mm. Very well. I suppose it is. A little bit. I thought having a son would give me an ally. A representative. You're a piece of shit. Instead, I find you intending to give away everything and ruin the Brooks legacy. <sighs> Vincent, I appreciate the time and care you and mom put into raising me, but... You always said you wanted to trust me to make my own decisions. Why are you surprised? Huh. I said that because I thought you would make the right decisions, obviously. So you're... Oh, I hate this guy. But at least I found one competent person, at least. Christine! Get in here! Yes, sir. Is there a problem? I'm going public with the news. Welcome to the family, Miss Brooks. Oh? What? Christine is my daughter. At least as far as the inheritance is concerned. Wow. Isaac... This guy is a piece of shit. The book's legacy can't be allowed to sink into the mud. Sorry, Isaac. I'm sure you understand. Not at all. I'm not sure I do. How could I say no? Unbelievable. Vincent clears his throat. Isaac leaves without a word. I want to say you should both be ashamed. Have a good one. You already sleep well, my dude. Yeah, I'm standing here in an angel outfit. You should both be ashamed. Oh, no, you don't. Mr. Brooks doesn't have time for you today or any day. How them boots taste. The door slams firmly behind you. You don't see Isaac anywhere in the office. You find him outside, seeming... Er. See, sometimes the, the text messages are wrong. Like, it's saying like he's saying it. You find him outside, seemingly enjoying the Whoa. sunshine. Well, I'm free. How should we celebrate? Celebrate what? Sorry, that's probably the wrong word. I'll be sad later, I'm sure. I'd almost be sad thinking of what my father and I could have had. But I wanted us to have. As for the money, I wanted it to go to charity. But that's all. That's out of my hands now. Mm -hmm. Right now, in this moment, realizing I owe nothing to the man is... A relief. Well, not just a relief. Also an emptiness. I confess, I'd rather not be alone tonight. You don't have to be alone. Well some, oh, well, some things are between me and God. Like the bathroom, but you're mm -hmm. right. Spending time with you would be nice tonight. Maybe at my place? I mean, I don't want to push you if you're uncomfortable. Or we could just find a restaurant instead. Where do you want to go? Let's go to a restaurant. You discuss the options. Eventually, he leads you to Ravira. I've, I've been here before. Oh, yeah, it's that guy. Okay. Welcome, Mr. Brooks. Your usual table. Uh, uh, that name grates on the ears. Brooks. Oh, I should find a new one. We sit down and enjoy it. A fine five course meal together. I'm still like hankering for that mac and cheese that Sawyer brought us. That sounds awesome right now. Nothing like cheese and bread and good company to soothe the soul. I I know we didn't talk about my father much, but you were still a great comfort to me. Thank you for the wonderful evening. You kiss Isaac goodbye and he and it and Kiss Isaac goodbye and eventually head home. Is that supposed to say and eventually head home?
Celebration. That means he came three times. Uh, what the fuck? I can't believe that just came out my brain. I don't think emojis are appropriate here. Oh, could you imagine if it was the prey things in the in the eggplant emojis? Oh, I knew I should have went with that option. It would just be fucking hilarious every time. I'd rather focus on our lovely evening. It was tasty. I'm glad. What a summer it's been. And it's all started in the dunge. Okay, just one. Okay, now where? I did the cat. I did him. Oh. Check out Seven. You pet cats for a while with Seven. He seems on edge. I get upset, or I get upset thinking about how sidekicks die. In Chrono Sight and in that movie, you know? You okay? Yeah. Yeah, I'm just angry. Sidekicks are always sacrificing themselves. It's dumb. He would have been a way better hero. Mm. If he took over from the protagonist, that would make him a villain, right? Potatoes. Potatoes thing. I'm a potato. I'm a potato. Thanks for contributing, Birch. Uh, it follows. We groove Tato. Mmm. -hmm. The big tones. The potato. I, I like how it wiggles. Like, if you do this. <laughs> if you took out of it, he'd be a villain. Or a spinoff. So, maybe it's... Maybe it's possible. Someone who says the name change wasn't his idea, and our agent talked him into it. He even invited me to make a duo with him. Lucky Seven. I don't know if he means it. Meanwhile, I've been thinking about going solo without Sungwoo. It'd be tough. Uh. But if I'm ever going to take the risk and go solo, now is probably my best chance. But if that fails, I could lose everything I've worked so hard for. Sungwoo is the more popular one, so I do it would be more guaranteed to succeed. Seven releases a long, unsteady breath. Uh. My thoughts keep going like this, round and around. How do I make a decision like this? What do you really want? Hmm. I guess... I want to be really good at something, and I want some someone to love. Is there anything else I should consider in my decision? Why did you get in the biz? I can't decide for you. You trust him. I trust him. I don't trust our manager. And Sungwoo can't be impress can be impressionable. Is there anything else I should consider? Uh, why'd you go into showbiz? Well, it was sort of an accident. Sungwoo was discovered by a talent scout first, and he dragged me into it because he used to dance together to music videos for fun. <laughs> I'm only in Blade Generation because of him. Maybe I'm being ungrateful. Is there anything else I should consider? Uh, I can't decide for you. Don't worry, you're not. I just really value your opinion. You're important to me. Please, help me think it through. What would you do in my position? If it were you, what would you do? Please be honest. Uh, You know what? If you have a friendship with Sungwoo, go do it with him. You feel like this is an important decision. Seven is listening carefully. 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 I just said the duo, right? Definitely duo. Seven relaxes back to the couch with a smi small <laughs> smile. It is so relieving to hear you say that. For a moment, there was I was sure you were going to tell me to go solo. And now I don't have to act brave to impress you. I can just do the smart thing. Catchy. Chain Lightning has a chance to immediately fire a second time. Woo! I like that. Sungwoo will be so happy. It's been a while since we've hung out, just the two of us. Now we'll be on tour, just the two of us. Maybe... And you? Maybe? It actually makes me look forward to going on tour. <laughs> hey! Are you Sungwoo? Surprise! Did I hear something about a tour? Does that mean you made a decision? Seven sits up straighter as someone familiar looking approaches your table. You realize you've seen this face on Blade Generation posters. What? Sungwoo? How did you know I was here? Sungwoo glances at Seven's oh. phone. Oh, right. Our agent's tracking device. It's fucked up. But now that you're here... Uh, Sungwoo, this is Big Papa. The wielder I've been talking about. Big Papa, Sungwoo. Sungwoo hey. shrugs. Nice to meet you, Big Papa. But this isn't about you, right? 
I heard he cut up some apples for you. So I guess it's serious. As long as you help Seven make the right decision, we're on the same side. Uh, I don't know why I gave him an accent. Yeah, so I thought about it from every angle. And there was only one way everything made sense. We should be a duo. Lucky Seven is the perfect combination. I mean, if you're still up for it. Seriously? That's the best news. Oh man, we're gonna tear it up. Oh my god. I have one condition though. Seven raises an eyebrow. We gotta fire our agent. She'll probably sue us, but it'll be worth it. She's toxic. Fuck what? yeah, get rid of him. Kick him to the curb. But who's gonna line up the gigs and, and promotions? Hmm. We'll find someone. Maybe Big Papa can help. Don't fucking count on me. I don't know anything about this shit. That's not his... Yeah, it's not my job. That's not his... Re That's not really his job. But it doesn't seem like he'd be good at it. It does seem like he'd be good at it. What do you think, Big Papa? You want to be our agent for the summer? Uh... I don't know. Don't worry. Nobody will make you. We have dungeoning... Dungeoning... To do anyway. <laughs> Seven smiles at you and squeezes your hand. Bro, it's gonna be amazing. <laughs> this is like the best moment of our life. My life. Lucky Seven forever. Sung Woo rushes Seven and takes him into a bear hub. Seven wipes his eyes discreetly. Aww, this is adorable. Ah, oh, jeez, I always forget how strong you are. Can't breathe, man. Hmm. Sorry, bro. Yesterday was arm day at the gym. So I guess we should have a band meeting? A duo meeting? Soon, soon. For now, let's celebrate and get out of here before anyone recognizes us. <laughs> Seven smiles. You feel yourself smiling back without relays, and you're doing it. You spend the evening discussing logistics. Eventually, you head home. My freaking nose won't stop. Eaching. Oops. Hey, I know it's a little silly, but I miss you already. I saw you like two seconds ago. I hate it here without you. Let's hang out again soon. Sure thing. See you in the dungeon, I hope. Sounds good. What time is it? I have 15 minutes. Where are we going? Ugh. Where's Valeria? What happened to her? You find Sunder waiting at a bench, listening to the crickets. Hey, cutie. Been working hard, huh? Going to the dunge, making friends. I don't know how you do it. You work and work and just keep working. Maybe it's just because it's been 200 years, but life seems exhausting to me. Vampirism sounds tough. You sound, you sound burned out. That's what it is. Yeah, probably. Though not by the sun, eh? Ew. I don't know. Vampire life was cool at first. I guess everything loses its appeal over time. Probably. Thunder clears his throat. Do you want... I don't think you want any of those. Mm -hmm. So was there anything you wanted to ask me about the vampire situation? What's the deal with Mandy? Yeah, I was going to say, it's, she's the one that turned him. Mandy's my blood brother, and it has been since 1812 or so. I was a nobody in Benares, India, when she found me, turned me, and took me in. So here I am, eternally young, because she liked my face. Uh... We haven't been lovers in a long time, if that's what you're wondering. You literally drink blood, and you turn into a bat. Are there werewolves too? That's the big question. Short answer? No. Long answer? Death wolves have some moon-related baggage. Hmm. And they've never migrated to California, so I won't worry about it. No! I want to be a werewolf instead. Can you turn into a bat? What? Turning into a sword isn't enough for you? But no, I can't. No invis invisibility either. At least not yet. Maybe when I get older? Yeesh, uh, I hope no older vampires are watching us right now. Creepy. But I am allergic to sunlight, garlic, and churches. Oh well. You uh -huh. literally drink blood? Yeah. It's not bad. It mixes well with vodka. I almost don't miss normal food. Except fried dough. I'd kill to eat a donut. But even donut makers don't taste... But even donut makers don't taste similar. That stuff. That's a bummer. I could go for some donuts, too. Fuck, I'm hungry. Now I get to ask you a question. The table's turn. Enemies who die while bleeding explode. Can explode. Not always. That's a bummer. Fair warning, it's a bit of a doozy. I've been feeling restless and purposeless for the last 50 years or so. What would you do with 200 mm. years? What do you really, really want? Honestly. Happiness. Yeah, same here. I just want to enjoy life, you know? Every moment. Too bad everything is so much work. Even just thinking about the next 100 years is so tiring. Everything reminds me of death. 
like all like it's all rotting and doomed ah stop it oh well i'm sure you didn't come here to hear me whine or me right put those away <laughs> i didn't consent to this i've got a sharp edge this body and infinite nights left i shouldn't be complaining one day at a time <laughs> yep that's my style or in my case one night at a time huh I should head home before the evil sun cooks Ew. me. He gives you a wave and saunters in the dark. You head home. Later. Not much to do in the daytime here. Mostly just talk to the spiders. How's your day going? Same old, same old. Life, that's life, I guess. Work, work. The dungeon feels less like work with you, though. I'll say that. Thanks, man. I still haven't tried my new erection DIY thing. We're doing that right now. Wait, fuck. Rowan. Rowan, 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 Rowan. Right? He said meet him at his house. Aha! I remembered a thing. Mansion's front door does not have a doorbell. Only a raven-headed door knocker. Not sharply. The door is cold against your fingers as you wrap it against the door. The door swings open. It seems dark inside. Hello? Tor a horse or a horse chuckle rasps from within the mansion. A horse chuckle. That's what I almost said. Or a chores huckle. A horse chuckle. Nay! I'm sorry, but I'm not. Nothing more. Ah, uh, well, was that the bird? Enter. You hesitantly step inside, but it's so dark that it takes your eyes a moment to adjust. <laughs> a coarse chuckle rasps from the shadow. Nothing more. Only this and nothing Gosh. more. Yep. He's not... He's saying... It's a reference to nevermore, but he's saying nothing more. That's funny. Hush, Crowley. No jokes right now, please. Please don't mind him. Thank you for coming. The tea is... Ne the, tear. the tea is nearly ready. Nothing more. You find in, you're in the sitting room that smells of dusty feathers and moldy fabric. Good day. Welcome. Since you said you like tea, I made a fresh blend. Saffron, rose, cardamom. I hope it calms our nerves enough that we can endure the appraisal. The appraisal will be here soon. But please don't try your usual seduction tactics. What? I don't... Usual seduction tactics? Have you met me? I don't have those. He seems both lonely and bitter, which is dangerous. Let's use the light touch. Follow my lead. You know him well? No. Not well, no. But he isn't subtle. Nothing more. Is it uh, fucking Brooks's dad? Isaac's dad? He thinks he's the Hierophant. Or maybe Justice. But he... No! It's Eric. He's just a knight of swords. Knock at the door, interrupts you both, which then opens. Fuck. Well, hello, lovelies. I wasn't expecting Big Papa as well. You're a sight for sore eyes. Ha! Mm -hmm. Are you here to bid on the estate items as well? I'm gonna let Rowan answer. You sip your tea, delicious, layered, and Rowan meets your eye with a small, grateful smile. Big Papa is my associate, serving as a witness. That is all. Do you like some tea? I harvested the leaves this, just this morning. No. I'd rather not waste my time, no matter how exciting my... No matter how exciting. My story has been... Has to be closed while I'm here, after all. Let's just see the blades and be done with it. Rowan brings out a long silk wrapped package that they unwrap to reveal a sword and a sickle. They're family heirlooms from the British side of the family. Well, the sword is in the style of an ancient Briton around 2,000 years ago. It's fine workmanship for a replica. I'll give you 300 for it. Rowan clears their throat and speaks almost too quietly to be heard. No. It's not a replica. Ugh. This isn't a 2,000 year old sword, my dear NB. Be reasonable. It's a blade the Boudicca wielded when she defeated the Romans and chased them from, from Wales. Holy shit. Uh. Eric blinks and blinks again. He clears his throat awkwardly, gathering his thoughts. Yeah, I see you don't know shit. First of all, Boudicca didn't defeat the Romans. They defeated her, sadly. Oh. Imperialist propaganda. Second of all, if you think this blade is more than 50 years old, you're dumber than you look. 
Oh, I want to punch him right in his stupid throat. Whether you're trying to deceive me or have been deceived is immaterial. Do you have a certificate or some other documentation I can inspect? Roman doesn't respond. Eric snorts and turns his attention to the sickle. Here, there's a bit of family resemblance, hmm? What is this, a cousin? You tell me. Hmm. Well, it's potentially a bit older than the other. Maybe a hundred years or so. What is this crest? You're the expert. Smart. Now, now, don't sulk. It ruins your pretty forehead. Shut the fuck up. The crest adds a bit of exotic flavor. Not many collectors of sickles, though. It'd be... So I'd, I'd also... So it'd also be $300. I see. So do we have a deal? You won't get any better off anywhere. Never sure. more. Tell your pigeon let the jokes to do the, do the negotiating. And I'll increase my offer to 350 Facts. Punch him right in the dick. Look, if you think being called a pigeon is an insult, you're hopeless. Every knows pigeons are the most romantic of birds. You should just go. Ah. $400. That's my final offer. Why not reap the benefits of my expertise, hmm? I fucking hate this guy. I said leave. Now, just go vampire on him. Werewolf, whatever, I don't care. Eric has his and looks to you. A flintly defiance in his eyes. Don't fucking look at me. I must sip my tea. Your tea seems to taste even better as you watch Rowan transform. Ah. Yes, get him. You're not the sharpest tool in the shed, are you, Eric? Eric makes a hasty to so get the fuck out of here, you piece of shit. Oh, well, I should have known better than to trust a profane merchant. Besides which, his aura seems to be sickening, as if it were rotting. I wouldn't have sold him them to him, even for millions. I was most curious. What is a sickle? Do you need money? What is a sickle? A sickle belonged to Shla Shlashka. Wow, I don't know how to pronounce that. The great druidess of holy fire. I wanted to know what... What that was worth to people today, and now I do. Are you anciently old too? I wish Alice was here to tell me what to do next. Then I wouldn't have this problem. Early preens Rowan's hair gently, making a soft clicking sound. Thank you for your support today. Of course. Gravity wells also do damage over time to any enemy being afflicted or affected by them. Gravity wells explode and do damage when they expire. Damage over time, constant. You said you wanted to wield me for love. Before. Today, you were very passive, but I know I urged you subtly. So, that's what I asked for, right? I don't know how I urge your loyalty, but I'm glad I have it. Oh, do you want, um... Want some flowers? Voted most cheerful in their graduating class. That might be for Sawyer. Shit. Want some flowers? Yes! I've been wanting bouquet of daisies. Perhaps your psychic abilities are growing, Big Papa. Bye. Early, that's a bit abrupt. But yes, I would look forward to the dungeon if you want to wield me. Perhaps we can go scythe-seeing. I'd like that. Excellent. Good day, then. I like Rowan. Rowan's a, a contender. You and Eric have an unhealthy resonance. Soul Residence! Ah! Anyone gets the reference? I would avoid him if I were you. I'm trying. I, you know what? I kind of pity him, but I also fucking can't stand him. I'm trying. Literally. And yet his orbit grows tighter. Take care. Fuck. No! I don't want him around! God fucking damn it. <laughs> Excuse me. Where's Valeria, dude? Now I gotta go watch Soul Eater. <laughs> dude, the fucking... That's one of the animes where I won't skip the intro song. It's so good. And it's timed with the, the animation sequence. So freaking good. I don't know where Valeria is. And that's upsetting. It's so far it's between Valeria, uh Sawyer, and Rowan. Also, the cat, just because 
I, I'm curious about what the fuck the cat is about. You know? Oh, I made everything. That's right. Rowan, you're so out of level. Alright, let's 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 do a dive with Rowan. And then uh, we'll call it. Plus, I want to try out my new erection thing. No, I don't want an actual answer. Thank you for clarifying. What secrets can we dig out from this pit? Okay. I have... Blam! A turret! Holy shit! It moves! Oh, we're gonna have a turret army. Yes! Oh. No, it disappeared! Shit, it's not like the bugs. No! Ah. Oh. How very upsetting. It's not like the bugs. Oh, damn it. That's really upsetting. I just murdered him. Ah! You didn't die. Damn it, dude. I like the bugs because they just follow me forever. I might have to turn on the uh, music got louder. The head oh, I thought those were bad things. The headsets at some point. Because I'm curious to see what the different music would be. Oh, I need those. Not really, but I'm going to take it anyway. my little boy go murdering the things get him ah that was a lot of laser coming at me what the fuck how did you guys spawn I went there a second ago what were you reaping so yep look at my awesome little angel outfit Nope. Oh shit. Oh shit. I didn't mean to do that. Fine. Ah. Things just die too fast. It doesn't even proc. Ah. Date time with Rowan. I don't see the value. Nothing? Ah, oh, yes, spirits. Did I ever tell you about the time I met Jack Daniel? The Jack Daniel? He's a bit of a narcissist even after death, but energetic if you let him talk about himself. Name dropping? After death? Well, I spoke with his resonant echo more than his spirit, per se, but yes. Fame is powerful in the emotional realm. People like Mr. Daniel thrive there. His whiskey's reportedly often not the best, but he said that wasn't the point. He had other goals. What goals? Throwing shrugs, and certainly. I didn't want to interrupt. The connection was weak. He probably sought the usual love, or power, or uh. both. Rowan eyes you thoughtfully, but shrugs again, standing and stretching. Do you want... Some... Eyeliner? Fuck yeah, dude! I do appreciate tools of drama and beauty. Thank you. Cool, you're getting all the lipsticks too, then. Enough of this. Look at me skipping around. Why am I going all the way over here? Oh, yeah. This thing. Hello, shopkeep. I'm sure you don't have anything I actually care about. I just bought a thing. It's fine. Oh, my God. It would have been so much cheaper to buy it from here. It's about spending seven or $100. I don't even need anything. I've built everything. Fuck. Just wasted so much money. I mean, whatever. I wasted $15. It's not a big deal. Oh, you're maxed. 
Okay, we gotta start with the... The people I suck with. So, Isaac, sorry, I suck the most with you. Holy shit! Why are you attacking so fast? Use a... I'm, the la it seems like you attack fast because the last weapon was slow. I miss my bugs! Ouch. Oh, sneaky. Ow. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. I almost fucked that up. Ah! Oh! Shit, wrong buttons. Fine. I know what I'm doing. I'm good at this game. Get him, turrets. Glue, my favorite. You wanna play some billiards? Oh yeah, we already did this with you. Oh? Oh, I should have done something wrong. Sorry, shit. Oh, sorry, I left my mind wander. I just often wish I could try the... Oh yeah, you said the same thing. It's fine. That's croquet, blah, 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 blah. Yes. Get that. Uh... Not drink the monsters, yes. Next level. It takes so long to level them up now. We did this one before too. Maybe it's like they're taking longer because they're hoping that you would just do other playthroughs at this point. You know? Ah! Fucking stupid. Walked into that. Um, maybe they're just be like, hey, it takes a long time to level up beyond yeah, this point. You know, I'm pushing the wrong button. I keep pushing the wrong button. My nose is just, I have no more heals. Need this. Aha! On guard! Fucker. Aha! I like them apples. I really need life. There's one. That's a lot of things. Oh! Thought I was gonna counter both of them. Fuck! I'm just not paying attention. Ouch. Ah! Thought I died right there. Hurry up and level up, Isaac. I'm getting my ass kicked here. Shit. Your fucking nose. What is down here that makes my nose itch so bad? Ah! Dog essence. Oh, 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 oh. Hmm. Yep, We've done this. Done this. Mm -hmm. Uh, oh, wait, no, we haven't. I do wonder what cocktails the next bird bought and a bite put into it. Let's make one. <laughs> oh, there's a bull inside my... Well, let's see what we can do. He pulls that out and sort my liquors and liqueurs. Together you select a few. There's no stirring spoon. Here, use me to stir. Stir it and then we'll see. Can you imagine trying to stir a shot or something with a freaking sword? You stir, stir it and have a taste. I was gonna say, it's gonna taste like steel. You almost spit it out. It's like someone poured cough syrup into a handful of dirt. Well, we tried. In retrospect, a waste of fine cardamaro. But we learned the process. <laughs> Let's leave the bartending the bartender, shall we? Ah! There we go. My tailor will adore me for using these. Thank you. Our talents lie elsewhere. Sweet. 
Cool. So he's leveled up. Uh, we will do seven next. Get out of here. Go down these stairs. All right, seven. Ah, god damn it. Play some pool seven. What do you think? Am I more of a solid or a stripe? What? That's a weird question. I guess I just wonder how you see me. I can't help it. You're one of the only people who knows the real me, you know? It's a new feeling. He smiles. Do you wanna... This? Sure. I'm pretty sure Valeria would've liked that more, but it's fine. Thanks. It's so rare to have a gift hand delivered these days. <laughs> Thanks for taking some time to recharge our batteries. I probably should've waited. I didn't realize... The gifts were for like the experience there those are probably meant to use for end game because it takes so long to get them leveled up the players in the weapon for i'm ready to return to the dungeon isaac has something to say to me meet you at the mission Oh, give me this. Go around. There you go. Oh, I got a holy energy. I spent a hundred dollars on that before. Look at the zappies. Amazing. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, the best part of a concert. The backstage hangout afterwards. You don't like performing? Mm -hmm. Of course I like performing, but it's a lot of work. In fact, it's so much work, everyone at Blade Generation never gets any time to actually hang out. There's training and rehearsals and events. It never ends. I really like escaping all of that in Verona Beach. It made it really relaxing. Back backstage might be really different when it's just me and some woo, but I hope you'll be there. I don't have anything because I gave it to you. You said night to get better. Now we have performance to finish here. Let's give those monsters an encore. Okay. Alright, feeling a little bit better because I have some heals again. Look at the zaps! Incredible. Everyone get zapped! Get back here. I want to zap you. Oh! Broken wall. Pick up this thing, jeez. Oh, I need that. What the fuck? Oh, he's just a big hand. Alright, let's go in the side room. Listen that freaking guitar go, dude. I was just there. You guys spawning right where people were already dead. Uncool. Laser beam. Blue. My favorite. Stared at that laser beam as it came straight from my face. All 
All right, how you doing, Seven? You're not fully leveled, right? Oh, so very close. Oh. Oh. I haven't found one of those yet. Or at least I never realized when I had one of those before. Secret stairwell. Ah. Sneaky. Trying to come zap me with his bad music note. That's a lot of lasers. Get him, turrets. Wait, did my turrets just get deleted? Because I summoned two of them and I didn't see any of them show up. Yep, you don't like these. Uh, there isn't one. And we don't have to waste time at bars. You better have things to do, better get out of the way. Like, be down. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. The chain lightning is dope now. Do you get... The, uh, the vines. Vines? Zines. Do you get those randomly per, per playthrough? Alright, Sawyer. Oh, shit! I meant to do, um... Sunder. Sorry, I eyes the cocktail bar skeptically. I don't know if I like most alcohols. They kind of taste like poison, you know? Some are sweet. They are poison. We can have soda. No. I don't know. The quality of soda at these places is usually pretty bad. I guess I feel weird about drinking because my old roommate got alcohol poisoning at a party. Oh, boy. I saw pictures of them in the hospital getting their stomach pumped. Sorry, your shutters. You don't have to drink. Sorry, relax is exha exhaling. I know I don't, but it's good to hear you say it. Thanks for understanding. For now, let's get out of here, huh? Do you want a... Picture? Maybe I should just keep buying those. Oh, cool. Digital camera. I like it a lot. Thanks, Big Papa. Um, maybe... Can I keep crafting my stuff? If so, I should fucking keep doing that. I thought I only could craft it once. Because it says crafted. In the craft screen. Oh crap! I'm not seven. That just one shot him. Holy crap. Amazing. because I'm an idiot. I keep thinking I'm playing with, uh, seven. A box. Yeah. 
Yeah. Good job, little turret. Hey, you want to sing? What? Oh, I love small venues. Seeing a musician up close is cooler than in a big arena. Looks like there isn't a gig here right now, though. Monsters are probably bad at bo booking. I don't think I have anything else for you. Mars Guy and McQueen are from Verona Beach, so maybe I'll see them here someday, even though they're famous. I'll go with you. Uh, if I manage to get my hands on two tickets, she'll definitely get the other one. I don't really know how to dance, but good music makes your body move, you know? They give you a shy smile. Do you continue back to the dungeon? So you're fucking precious, dude. Uh, oh my god. Sawyer, you do so much damage. Keep your little love hearts to yourself. I don't want none of it. Which I suppose I just said I want all of it, but it's fine. Uh, I don't need that. It's fine. Get out of my swamp. Actually, I do want it because I'm hurted and I'm missing one. Thank you. Going down. Damn it. Not quite there yet. Ow. That hurt a lot. Screw you, grabby hand. I'm in like a witch zombie hand. Get out of here. Yeah, yeah, nobody wants you around in these parts. I don't know what that exclamation point above my head does for me. Maybe there's like invisible guys and it's warning me. I am unsure. All right, there's a lot below me. Can I squeeze? Ah, uh, it's fine. Well, fancy, I've never met. Oh, yeah, we've done the very important one. Uh huh. Uh... Alright. There's a lot of boys down here. I guess we're gonna go to the right. Laser beams. Dude, the little turrets almost murdered that thing by themselves. Ouch! Didn't see that. I'm a fool, I am. There we go. Change weapon. Alright, Sunder, you're up. get to the actual weapons I know how to use. Cool. Boss fight time. <laughs> That's funny. I fought this guy literally the exact same uh, situation last last time I was here. Switch to Sunder, immediately fighting heart boss. My nose itches so bad right now. I'm getting hit because I'm trying to itch. Let's take a nose. Listen to these tunes. Money. 
I'm a vanquisher. I'm an expert. I'm a first rate. It always just keeps repeating itself. Because I was a veteran before. All right, I think uh, we just need Valeria and the cat, right? Oh, my nose, God. Uh, it's surprising to me, but I started looking forward to our outings. Is this train do want to be used? Is he talking kink? Not so strange. Good, I'm strange enough already, I think. What do you mean used as a weapon? Even so, maybe we should have an outing that isn't functional. Maybe I've been spending too much time with the moon. Let's get some sun at the park. Sure. Let that no, that was a valid question, Birch. Don't laugh at me. How else do you take that question? Is it strange to want to be used? How else are you are you supposed to interpret that, that question? Oh dang, oh dang. I already owe you one or two or three, but I have to ask. I'm in trouble with my prof. Can you come back me up to college? I'm not good at standing up for myself. Absolutely, I'll be there. Building H, room five. I'd like to talk to you with you again about things that matter. Can you meet me at the mission one more time? Sure. Thanks. I have a little present for you. So, look at Seven All opening up. I don't know if you like the beach, but meet me here there maybe 7 p.m.? Okay. See you. Yeah, I have something to tell you. Let me know when you have a second. I'll come over. Okay, I guess now is good. Son of a bitch. You wait for someone to show up. You wash your hands just as there's a knock at the door. Man. Thanks. Hi. Oh, weird timing, but I, uh, I have some bad news. You feel your chest get heavy as the weight we're pressing down. As clear as day, you see Sunder's face that he's about to break up with you. Your mind resists, imagining how things could be different between you. Don't tell me how I feel. I kind of don't mind. You imagine a reality in which he had infinite love to give his heart yours forever. Can't my fantasy be real? I want three. It's undersized, stealing himself for what he's about Even to say. Even we're just friends, I have to say, I don't think we should see each other anymore. Not, not like we have been. I'm not enough for you. I never was and never will be. I've loved spending time with you and seeing the world through your eyes. Ooh, heavy finishes is awful. So briefly stun enemies. Heavy finishes also steal life. Love it. Made me remember what it's like to be. I don't use heavy with him. Fuck. Me. You're great, but your friendship deserves more time than I can give. Mandy warned me about you. Energy. I'm too old or too lazy or I just can't. I'm sorry. Hmm. If there's one thing I've learned in 2000, 200 years, it's self-care. Okay. Yeah? Uh, good. Great. Cool. Or were you just trying to pull reverse psychology, which is a bullshit tactic. Don't fucking do that. I wonder if you're actually okay. You aren't sure yet. I'm totally fine. We've had fun, haven't we? As far as I'm concerned, that's a win. Uh... I had one of these, I had one of these around, so I thought you might want it. You're a good wielder, after all. He gives you a small but heavy wooden box. You open it to find quartz whetstone. Don't read too much into it. It's just a packed piece of rock, okay? With a whetstone, you're a master wielder. You gain double love with all weapons, unlimited by love rank. What? Maybe you'll find someone more deserving you can use it on someday. But other than that, I guess this is the end of an era. A change, at least. Uh, I guess I'll just get out of your hair. See you later, I hope. He lets himself out. Your throat feels tight, constricting. You've reached max level, love level with Sunder. You are his pass in a blurry haze until you, you fall into a light sleep. Does he have a lower love level? Because Valeria was higher than his, but I didn't reach max for her. 
You're woken by a knock. Through the people, you see a worried looking Mandy. Come in. Hey. Hey, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I tried to help you, but. Well, you deserve better. That's all. Do you love him? <sighs> I guess I do, yeah. Like a little brother. Makes it hurt more to see him keep doing this. Sometimes I think he'll learn something, but he never does. So, I knew what kind of man he was when I turned him those years ago. Yet I still keep expecting better. Maybe I'm the stuck one. We do our best to make me a vampire? Man, this game is thirsty for making me a vampire. <laughs> I tell myself that. It doesn't help much. I don't normally do this, but... Want a hug before I go? Sure. You let her wrap you in a surprisingly strong hug. You feel her inhale deeply. Oh. Wow. I can see what Sunder was crazy for. You smell delicious. Don't turn vamp on me. Sorry. Too soon? Too soon. Keep being good, Big Papa. You're at it. You're better at it. Than most. There's the words. She gives a little wave as she leaves. And you lock the door behind her. Okay. Can I... I actually can't build these again. Okay. Do, 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 do. I heard everything's okay with Sunder. Are you okay? I'll be okay. That's all anyone can hope. I'm here for you guys. Thanks, Jesse. You're cool. Mandy said she came to see you. I'm sorry for everything. I hope she didn't make it worse. I don't like any of these. These are all kind of dicks. Whatever. Oops. Sorry, I hope we can still fight together sometimes, but I know I asked for space, so I'll stop bothering you. Okay. Ah! Fuck. I want to go on a date with Rowan. Well, okay, well, my friends, full screen thing not working again. I don't know what the deal is, but it worked bef literally right before stream. Now that I go live, it doesn't. So that's fine. But my friends, this is where I'm going to call it. Um, I guess we're going to keep playing this tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow is when we finish it. Um, online said it's only like 10 to 12 hours of gameplay. And uh, we're at the... I guess we're only at like the nine-ish hour, so I guess that kind of makes sense. Um, no, because I started Thursday. Yeah, nine hours. So um, I guess we'll keep playing until we beat it. Um, I, it could those times could be including people just kind of beat the game and they don't level up everyone, which I'm kind of trying to do. Which also I think kind of ruins the immersion because you're supposed to be like falling in love with them, right? But like a couple of these people, like Sunder, I never wanted a part of his business at all and it's like you'll feel your heart being thumped inside and pulled out of your chest pieces and it's no nah, i'm good so i don't know but um anyways my friends um let's see i believe kim might be streaming and if she is we might go raid her because I think she's playing Stray, and that game looks cute. That game looks cute as heck. Ah, mute. Uh, come on, Twitch. Cause we we, we raided Moira yesterday. Yeah, let's go read Kim. She's playing straight. It looks lovely. And she's just a lovely streamer to hang out with anyways. Uh, especially at the end of the night. Because she's very cozy. And very wholesome. And I love her community. Um, Come on. Raid. I can't type. I can't type. What the hell? No! OBS is doing the weird thing behind the scenes. I'm typing and it won't let me do it. Bruh. Now I can. What the hell? It's like... What the fuck, dude? Something's weird is happening. I don't know. I, I think the uh, the tool I'm using to make stuff 
overlay and stuff is freaking stuff out. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Remember to spay new to your pets, adopt a shop, donate to rescue if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and out that are very much in need. Anyways, I'm Vasive. Thank you so much for letting me do your stream tonight. I highly appreciate it, and I'll catch you all next time. See ya. Will this work? It better work. Let's go, Jada. Let's go bedtime. <laughs>